the sound of the internet stopping and realizing that Jordan has got the mic. Got the mic. Got the mic. Oh, hello. I didn't see you there. Thanks for joining me. Uh, John's like, no, it's broken. You're not even live. <laughs> damn it. Internet. There it is. <laughs> no, dude. Took a little bit. Hey, right, what I ad did it. you get? It. What ad did you get? Ladies and gentlemen, if you're checking out the stream. Okay, tell us. John. I didn't get an ad Why? because I use my Twitch Prime, which everybody gets if they've got Amazon Prime. Use your Bezos bucks for Myth Brigade or at least somebody else. Fuck. Yeah. Preferably us, but you know. That was good one, great. John. That was really that was good. great. I got, a, I got a Burger King ad, though, so Very I fully have not subscribed. I love I'm a Whopper. Of you. So real quick, sponsors. Not, not official sponsors. Sponsors are like Liquid Death. Yay. Voodoo Ranger, yay. Celsius, in case I fall asleep. Jordan, don't buy mm. boring. And then whiskey okay. on the floor. Yeah. In the <laughs> description below. Blood pressure cuffs. In case it gets too intense, <laughs> check your blood pressure. <laughs> it's all uh, yours, man. What are you going to do with us tonight? Uh, I'm going to destroy you. Uh, just kidding. We're going to have a good time. I'm super excited. Uh, really excited for Dion's people in the glass wall behind us to uh, continue cheering us on uh, as there. we take on the rest of the Red Rocket. Uh, if you guys did not check out the last one, literally stop watching and go watch that because it was a blast. Uh, and this is a continuation of our Fallout 2D20 campaign by Modifius uh, called The Nuka World Order. So, last time on... The Nuka World Order. The gang meets for the first time around the campfire, brought together by the mercenary broker known as Oh Cappy. Oh Cappy. He's been bragging about a hot job that's going to change their lives, but won't give them any details yet. He's insisted that he needed to test the resolve of the group and sent them out on an errand. A group of raiders are supposedly holed up at the Red Rocket not far away, and he's ordered them to take them out. We join them in front of the Red Rocket on the cusp of battle to prove their worth. To me. Not to be super meta, but I was at the back of the Red Rocket. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's fair. Uh, so the turn tracker should be pretty accurate, actually, I think. Oh, shit. I got to roll into it. I got to log into that, huh? Sorry. Uh, super important to actually be where the action takes place. Fun can, fact. Can you can you order it again where it's actually like automatically sorting because it's not again, right? At least not on my screen. Um, but it's not supposed to be. Shouldn't shouldn't it by initiative? Uh, well, hold on. Actually, it, it well hold on. It's not I, I on believe, your screen. I believe it is, it's but in we're order. in a turn order and Buck Casey delayed initiative or readied in action or something. Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. Maybe? It looks it looks about right to me. Um, we can't see the we can't see the the baddies. It's a zero yes. for me, but the the order is right. It just has me at the top because I was last. I was thinking because the, the seventeen underneath you. But if someone delayed turn, that's fine. All right, never mind. You should be. You should see at least one baddie, right? So Sir yeah. Jack Lancaster yeah. had that one, right? Right. The the seventeen underneath is because he's that that would be a whole new turn, right? It's just it's just 
like a circle feed. Well, in that case, the zero threw the, me off. The, but anyway, the, yeah, sorry. The, the raider, the raider gets it. <laughs> that's that's a a problem with the introduction of the raider. Yeah. A quick answer would have been, "It's right, David. Shut up." Sorry, David. <laughs> Buck fucking Casey. Buck Casey. I'm almost logged in, and and then that will show the the map to the stream, so they will be like, "Oh yeah, I remember this. This is oh, my I favorite." Remember. Here it comes. Uh, yeah, your dog agrees. It's not my dog. No, that's my dog. Yeah, no good. Not yet. Yeah. No shit. Yeah. <laughs> you ain't know when it's that dog. Yeah. yeah. Uh, excuse me, Jason. We're getting a lot of Tyrannosaurus Rex feedback in your streams. Can you actually take Jurassic Park down while you're streaming? <laughs> Dude, he's, he's fine. Uh, he did, though, accidentally bite my ear. Accidentally, as they do. And I was... I'm like, oh, he bit my ear, and then Lee goes, um, you're bleeding, and it was it was pouring down my neck, down oh my, my chest, down my chest, and uh, yeah, that was fun. Nice. So that'll be great. Yeah. So yeah. Jason adopted a zoo animal. What did the stream do? Put it in the chat. <laughs> What's your week been like? <laughs> nice. All right. So we're fine. Uh, you can okay, see the. We're good to go. Yeah, you can see the Jiffy story. You can see the meth addicts. You can see the Toxic Avenger at the back. Nice. Yeah, it's all good. Okie dokie. So, Jaeger, I think it was your turn where we had left off. Yeah, so actually, I think I had, it was like midway through, and I had just run around to the back because I heard stuff going on, and yeah. I was like, let me get around to the, the back here and uh, let uh, let them know that there's there's some stuff about to go on, and we can bust down this door and, and help out. Uh, so I ran around the back. I think that's, that's, uh, my minor move, whatever. And then I'm just going to pull out a Molotov and get ready to go. Okay. So you're, uh, you're prepping that. Yeah. I, th I think as you round that corner, right. Cause you're right there next to me. Cause I, I think I had just finished picking a lock with the, the eye that seems to not ever look in the right way. I'm looking at you. Right. <laughs> and the, the lock just goes click and I'm like, let's go get some. <laughs> so it's like a lazy eye kind of deal that just kind of I mean, like, no it's more like an eye that grows kind of up on your temple up here oh okay like gotcha a, uh, wow gotcha the all-seeing eye yeah. yeah or not oh my seeing, god not seeing eye depending on what jordan says it's fine <laughs> uh that's a good question um all right is that is that it uh jaeger yeah i think that's it okay buck i think you were next we're going to assume that the turn tracker is right. Okay. Um, I am just still, I'm just, I was trying to remember at this point, Buck still doesn't hear anything. He doesn't, I don't believe so. There's no actions. I see Mr. Uh, Dr. Mr. Handy doc, as I Thank call you. him. Yeah. He, he's, he's uh, moving forward. He started to move forward. Jack Lan uh, Jack, I couldn't put it. I almost said Jack Canister. <laughs> hey, Canister face. That's gross. That's just uh, gross. I'm just gonna be my professional. Man. Did you? Was there was there weapons fired in the engagement that you had with the Raider? Yes, but yeah. I have a silenced pistol. Oh, so I right. shot him you had in a the silenced arm. Pistol. Okay, and he has not gone yet. Um, so Correct. then, yes, you would have heard nothing, Buck. Yeah. So then I'm I'm still chilling. I'm hanging out. I'm just looking around. I'm I'm mainly looking around outside to see if any if we get, you know, flanked, but I'm just, you know, letting everybody else do their thing inside. So, um, really no action right now for me. Okay. Uh, the Raider that has just been shot <laughs> by, uh, Sir Jack Lancaster is going to attempt to lunge at him. Uh, let's see here. Rude. Yeah, Duke. I know. Sorry. Duke. Uh, <laughs> See if I do this right. I really should have uh, fixed this. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, that's bad for you. Uh, <laughs> no, that's good for me. Do you have it? Uh, why do you that's, have the advanced? No, right. because they want to roll low, right? They want to roll. So the one is a crit oh, critical success, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. Um, but. Tw 20 is the complication. 
Um, unless there's advanced complications in play, which I don't believe that there is now. I'm just double checking here, but I do Got not it. believe okay. that's in play, which means that uh, that's not great. Um, so that's two successes, and I have yep. a defense of two. Yep. Um, okay. do, 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 do. I'm checking out here. So he would have been lunging at you um, with his tire iron. I just wanted to double check what was going on there. I'm actually going to do what the easiest thing is and borrow the damage die from one of your characters. So I'm going to do this. We're going to roll this many. So even though it says Jack Lancaster, this is for my <gasps> dude. Oh. So that's two damage. Oh, wait. Oh, I see. Two damage, and then did you, you have? Oh, sorry. Roll sorry. to see where yep, the damage yep, is. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Uh, actually, I need to do that. Thank you very much. Uh, one, two, twenty. Right, it's randomized. If I didn't declare it before, which is a two, which I think is Grotum. the head. The head. That's what I thought it was. Bam! Not, just get clocked right yeah. in the noggin. Bam. What? I mean, I was crouched, so it kind of makes sense. Did you have any extra armor that was on, John? Not, not my head. <laughs> Whack! <laughs> Okie dokie. Okay. Uh, the raider gives you a big old whack in the head. Um, and okay. that's going to be what he does. Uh, what are you going to do after getting whacked in the head? Oh, damn, it is my turn. Okay. Okay. Uh, I still don't see anybody else, though, right? Um, no, you do not. Okay. Uh, I am going to... And this might be a question because I know the zones are kind of like inside the zone, leaving the zone. Yeah, I was going to say, let me think about this for a second. So when, it, when you entered, you had opened the door in a specific way that I'd given you kind of quick access in there. So I guess I'll have yeah. to ask the question, like, are you, are you scanning the room now or are your eyes still on... The, the raider in question. He got hit on the head, yeah. but he's pausing to scan the room. <laughs> oh, 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 what's going on? <laughs> Very much. Uh, I'm focused on the tire iron that just hit me in the top of the. Uh, yeah, that's all. So you're you're I'm, probably looking the same here. Yeah, I'm gonna back up towards the door though. I'm gonna take a shot and then try um, move out. And I can't remember if I can move, shoot, move in this one or not. Um, so one think. one zone I believe is a minor action. I, and if, then, but you can move also anywhere in the same zone. Like if you're trying to move out the door, that's the same zone, isn't it? Or, or yes, is that a separate it, zone? No, David's right. That's a free. That's a free action. So you right. don't. It, as long as you're in this same area. Got it. That was my question, though. I'm going to try to go out this back, like kind of just back to that wall yeah. out the door. So I'm going to say that's a minor action. Uh, no, I think that's actually okay um, because. Okay. I classified the little green dots on the map as the different zones, so I'm not going to mm. charge you for that. Okay. What were cool. the okay. what were the rules around like signaling, like uh, you know, like shouting for help or just being like, "Oh fuck my head!" <laughs> <laughs> Someone, uh, fuck yeah, my head. I don't know if like soliloquy is a uh, minor action or not. I need to. Uh, they don't, yeah, they don't have that. The, the, the only thing that would be closest would be something like um, what, rally? a rally, but a yeah. rally doesn't make any sense there. I think. I mean. Is it like D&D &D where like on your turn, you've got like an action and movement and also that's, you can say things for six seconds or That's what, what I was thinking, <laughs> Michael, is just kind of like, hey, you can blurt a little thing, but like don't recite Shakespeare maybe on your turn. No, that works. We just Unless don't you're want Dr. Mr. Handy. <laughs> well, okay, tree. fair. But but only like yourself. a couple... Only a couple of lines. <laughs> okay. <laughs> not to be smack. <laughs> Excuse you all. I'm a professional. Hello, I'm not going to Hello. say anything. Oh, I'm uh, talking about testicles. Uh... And <laughs> I'm going Never to. Thought I heard you say that. Yep. Stand up uh, to get you know a better aim at him and shoot him. Hopefully in the face. Hmm. Mm. Precisely. The... Critical success. Yeah. In the face. Um, so yeah. So you called that one. Um, so in the face. Yeah. Roll that beautiful oh. damage. Right. See. Well, you said, I mean, so I, okay. I wasn't actually technically calling it, but you so. did. Say, I mean, you did say in the face. <laughs> you did. Fair. You also did say I mean, take aim. Was his minor action taking aim? Oh, I forgot about taking And aim. you got two successes for that, fuck's sake in his face, in his word hole, in his tooth. Yeah, it's in, a, in, in his a tooth hole. I'm going yeah. in the word hole. He's not surprised, so I don't get bonus damage. 
That's God pretty damn. good. That's good. Yeah. So that's nice. Uh, play. He's fallen, John. Play it out for me. What's happening? Uh, it's just more of a. I reactively didn't see him. He startled me. I, you know, not very professionally. Took a quick shot. Hit him in the arm. He just bangs me on the head. I just stand up, basically in line with his face, and just pop him. And then I'm going to just lower down. And then, as my minor action, I guess, kind of look around. I'm just imagining like if this, anybody heard anything. I'm imagining this like some of those Bond movies where you just like see this like or assassin movies. It's like one dribble of blood just goes in here, and the guy just like kind of falls back. <laughs> Perfect. So he's toast. Can I ask a, a question on the damage? So remind me. So for the two damage that Jack took, um, because he didn't have any armor, is he just subtracting two HP? Is it just that? Yeah. So I did actually do or a little it bit. It goes of, against your defense, right? I kind of I, forgot. How this I did a little bit of research. It's still kind of vague to me, to be honest with you. I did learn though. I think the HP that's associated with the body parts is actually when power armor comes into play because apparently power armor can have its own set of HP that you can then deduct from. So I think that's why there's a tracker for that. Um, otherwise, I think the most important thing about it is like how much damage, like you can count up to it for injuries perspective. Once I think you hit five, then you get a injury on uh, wherever that hit location was. I thought that was in one turn though. And that was that was language that I wanted to clarify as well before I issued one, Michael, um, was whether or not that's a single turn or not. Yeah. Yeah. Got so it. the defense is how many successes you need to the enemy needs to hit you. And then the HP, I just took two HP because I didn't have any armor. Otherwise, it could have been um, deducted by damage reduction. So and remind me, defense doesn't do anything in that case. That's. Uh, Defense is how many successes the enemy needs to hit you. Right. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'm good. Basically, what, I, would, what I would kind of think of how agile you are. What gotcha determines the role? Is it a pass fail on the on the attack? That's the uh, uh, that's so the, that's your the the weapon the weapon that I'm using uh, determines um, what the what the difficulty is. Okay. It's a, okay. Thank you. I yeah. haven't attacked yet, so or no, I did try once and it failed. So okay. So like my pistols thing, there it'll it shows small guns and then agility. Gotcha. So I need yep. to get a twelve or below. Gotcha. Wait, is it is 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 defense number like added to something? No. Well, so Jack was saying that's, that's the number of successes one they one success. need. That's the number. So of successes is, if they you need. have if you have zero defense because you're not wearing any armor, is it just an automatic success? You should have defense. I mean, I only have one. There, it's, yeah, you should when have at you least one, I think. <laughs> when you, no, when you, think well, it depends on your values. So when you were doing your specials, there's a value, there's a minimum you have to hit to get any. And then if you don't have armor, you might technically. You can have zero, I think. It, I mean, zero difficulty skill check is possible. What if that you is, go in commando? You know? <laughs> <laughs> Plus four. That's a minus. That's a minus for sure. <laughs> no, but I mean, if you have a defense of zero, does that mean if I rolled like, as long as they didn't do a critical fail that I would always hit them if they had a defense of yeah. zero? I think so. That seems kind of that seems kind of broken. Well, no, because they still have a target to hit, so they would still need to roll their ability. Yeah, but you're saying that is zero, oh, but yeah. the defense no. is the number they need to pass. No, def defense yeah. yes. is the number of successes. If it's zero defense, I think it's an automatic hit unless yes, they. I think, I think that is correct. But if it happens, let's get to it. Just so we're not slowing Thank down. Thank you. Stuff. <laughs> okay. I just okay. murdered we a did guy. Mur we did murdering. Murder. Murdering just occurred. Was there anything else that you wanted to do there, Sir Jack? Uh, yes. Is my minor action? I'm just kind of like scanning the room real quick to see if there's any other hostiles, and then kind of ducking back down behind the counter. Yep. So as you're scanning, you are going to see um, wherever my reveal is. Um, you kind of get a gaze for the rest of the room. There appears to be. Another guy that is just kind of scanning these shelves. Uh, apparently, your silence situation uh, did not alert him uh, to what was going on. Um, I am going to go ahead and add in um, more zone here, though. I'm going to take this at about about halfway through the room there. So it's going to cost to get to the other side of the room. Uh, so he's kind of just perusing right now. You haven't seemed to draw his attention. Okie dokie. Gross face. 
I'm gonna open the goddamn door. Because I've been uh, waiting a while. So been yeah, waiting I, a long time. <laughs> yeah, I, I, fin- I, I, I think it's that moment where I've broken like 10 hairpins and I'm like, last one. And I think I succeeded. So I, I opened the door. Yep. yep, you open the door. I think Jaeger's there. So I want to I wanna coordinate. I don't know how this works because he's right after me in the turn order. No, no. Nope. I'm going to let you finish your okay. sentence first. Um, so I'm just... I want to open the door and observe what's going on in there. Yep. You're going to open the door to a raider with his pistol out who was, uh, whose job it was to guard the back door uh, that is going to try to pop off a shot. Question. Is, yes. is, is he at all? Okay. So he has no idea. Obviously, all this chaos that's going on in the other room with the other guys. Yeah. Shooting. So that was all silence. He has no so idea. He, did, he okay. didn't hear any of that stuff going on. His one job is to guard the back door. Okay. So since I have the initiative, is there, so I see him and I'm like, mm-hmm. shit. And I just push the door shut and duck. That that's my whole action. I don't want to get shot in the face. I I will I'll let you spend a luck point on it. Oh God, those are expensive. <laughs> All right, fine. I'll spend a luck. Fuck you! And I close the door and duck, and Jaeger gets shot in the junk as he's standing behind me. I think. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm off the side. <laughs> uh, you're gonna you're gonna hear you're gonna hear a pop uh, go in like to the door, as in like you know he shoots the door. Um, six of seven. Damn, I'm down to five. Okay. All right. Wait, luck. Luck is after every story, right? It is. Uh, I'm going to let you guys know when it refreshes. So basically, I'm kind of doing it like long rest style, right? So okay. as as the scene kind of thematically ends, the session we ended a little earlier than I had originally planned and intended, uh, oh. so that we could prioritize important things like Thor: Love and Thunder. Uh, I don't know if that was a good choice or not, Sir Jack. Lincoln. Don't say anything but, yet. I'm seeing it tomorrow. No, so we'll get. So the point is. I spend my luck point. Bullet comes through the. Did I just miss it because I spent a luck point? Like, oh yeah. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna hit you because you missed. Because oh, uh, you closed yeah. the door. Okay. How that would be an asshole GM move just to be like, hey, you did it, and yeah, you're dead. You're dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just, bro. So Sucks. I would. I would call out to Jaeger because obviously I'm aware he's there because he's not. He's just kind of running up on me. And I'd be like, uh, Raiders. There's only one that I saw. Yes, you see one. Right by the door. And I, I've got my hand up like this. And if it's at all possible, on his turn, I want to, like, if there's a helping mechanic where I could be like, huh, and Definitely. pull it open when he's ready to fucking murder somebody. Uh, yes, you can assist, but I think it's a major action. Yes, it's going to be one of your major actions. I mean, I'll do that sometime. I don't know. Like, I just, you open, well, point okay, is, I so didn't you, get shot in my, my weird eye. You interacted. That would have been your minor action to open the door, essentially. Okay. Right? So you do have a major action to spend. So that then, would be a ready, right? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I think it's an it's an assi- there's an assist though. Assist a character with their next test. So I think but that's I, specifically this. I, I, yeah, I'm not tr- I'm not going to be doing a test though, am I? Or or do you mean like he's going to help me throw the Molotov? Because I was thinking his action is just like when I'm ready to throw, he's just opening the door. Well, but but at the exact right time or something like I could see that Jordan. Like I'll hold it and look for look for his cue. So yeah. if you want it's to move like on to who's after. He's going to have his hand over your hand. And you're both going to throw it to yeah. you. <laughs> we're going to call it. We're going to call it an assist because I'm going to, we're going to skill check it for accuracy of timing. Yeah. Oh God. Okay. Yeah. Fine. Okay. Yeah. Okie dokie. Fantastic. Mr. Melty face. Uh, <laughs> we're all going to burn in death. <laughs> oh, God, that would be kind of funny though. Just be like, ah, damn. It's all on fire in the back. Oh my uh, god, that's the second time today uh, I've been on fire. Mr. Handy. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to kind of follow uh, Mike. What's your character's name? Sorry. Jaeger. Jaeger. I'm going to follow Jaeger. Uh, take a major action to sprint around uh, to. Yep, so that'll be two zones. Yep. Yep, so major action for that. While I'm running, yep. I'm probably going to say something like, I'm so excited, I have opening night jitters. <laughs> um, and then when I get around to the back door, um, I mean, they're, 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 I see them, what, they're both kind of around the door and like, yeah, you're like, yeah, they probably the look, now. they probably look kind of spooked because they just had yeah. this moment. I don't think you would have caught what they were saying. Cause you're running around the corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but you definitely kind of see that they're on alert on edge. Yeah. Oh, and <laughs> actually, and you see Jaeger with the Molotov. Right. So, I mean, obviously I can probably tell that there's like stuff going on, 
So um, I'm gonna, man, there's not really much I can do. I'm just gonna like, that's probably it. I'm gonna have like my, my, my uh, buzz saw kind of ready to go, but like an aim doesn't really make any sense or anything. So I think that's kind of it. Okay. Okay, bomb boy. <laughs> Bomb <laughs> voyage. Bomb voyage. That's it, dude. That is the name of this episode. Unless something cooler happens, that's fucking hilarious. Bomb voyage. All right. Yeah. So I'm gonna look to just. Um, did I get a look like through the door? Uh. Ooh. Like enough to see that there's not like it's just a hallway and it's a wall. Like I'm. There's a reason for me to lob this thing in there, right? I don't know if you would have gotten quite a look with the wall where it's kind of at. I, to be honest with you, like Fuck the it, way the art. <laughs> so, <laughs> I was gonna say the way we <laughs> repeat it. Like I don't even know if Jason got much of a look. He was like, ah! <laughs> I just saw That's that fine. he was We're wearing he was wearing spandex and fishnets at the same time. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even. Know. That's fine. I'm just gonna say it's like a it's like a you know like a ten foot lob. Just yeah. through the door, mm-hmm. just kind of giving it, giving it a, a nice heft so that the, the ring of fire isn't going to be like right at the door. Cause you know, I know how explosives work, so I know how far to get it away. Yeah. Fair. Sweet. I think that's fair. Uh, throwing te- What is it? Throwing explosives. I think it's a check. Uh, yes. So for mine, it says I can use throwing or explosives and I'm obviously going to use explosives, which is explosives oh, yeah, sorry. perception. It's, what- yeah, that's sorry. That's what I meant to say. Uh, so this is this is why I was wondering how it's an assist because an assist would actually help me with whatever stat he's using. So so what but I you would suggest to skill check it? is something along the lines of um, Jaeger <clears throat> eight feet in by the counter, and I like th- there's this moment right where I'm I'm trying to give him direction, and so whatever. Well, I, and I was I was thinking yeah. as well. So Jason closed the door. Right. So Jason's got it. I'm giving him the assist as the minor action. Basically. I, I mean, it's a major, but his assist is he's opening the door. So you're not getting charged with the opening mm-hmm. of the door, Michael. Um, right. So, so that's basically, and I mean, that's going to be a difficulty zero check essentially is what I'm going to do there. So give me a roll, Jason. No, I mean, it's opening a door that'll generate successes for you. That's why. Is you there a, what, what's the uh, skill? Oh shit. Yep. I just, um, oh. Sorry. This cable got struck by lightning two days ago, so I'm gonna keep doing this until it stops. You hear oh, that? It's a shock cable. Neat. Yeah, I know. Uh, oh, you stopped. Better. I think it's good. You're good. Just yeah, because I'm, I'm holding it. I'm holding it. Just hand? hold it yeah. the whole time. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> what, those old TVs. For fuck's sake, let me just roll some dice. What am I gonna roll? Okay, so you're going to roll. Do, 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 do. It doesn't matter. Um, <laughs> okay. I, I'm sorry. I, I'm going to roll ultimately, speech. Ultimately, you're rolling for success. Let right? me roll like, speech. Go ahead. Roll speech. No. I don't have much in speech. What, what am I going <laughs> to. No, really. Yeah. What, what it's, do a, it's, a difficulty, it's a difficulty zero check. So just do survival endurance. There we go. Bing, 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 bing. Hit the button. What's happening? Hang on. Sorry. Uh, additional dice. No, go. Here we go. I'm going to throw them so hard. Boom. All right. Add one to the AP pool. Oh, cool. And the door goes open. Right, yeah. I'm going to mute and Diff- figure this out. Are, are we at? Yeah. What's our AP count? Four at? now? I have four. Okay. Okay. I have, yeah, plus this one is four, right? Yes. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so then you're doing perception explosives, Michael? Yeah. So <laughs> Boom. Ooh. Oh, that's a lot. Damn. What was that difficulty? That's a lot. Uh, <laughs> that difficulty, oh, hold on, is not that high. Uh, one. So we got two more action points. Is there a cap on that? No, I'm not aware of a cap on action points. We Six don't need a cap. No, no nice. caps. I need cap. Oh, the only cap we need is old cappy. I got one cap. Yeah, um, you're the explosives expert. Yeah, so that was it. That was difficulty one. So you generate Let's two go. extra from that. And uh, you just throwing it out there. Could he use an a six, successful melee attack or thrown weapon attack? You can add AP, spend AP to add. 
a damage dice. Does an explosive count? Though? That sounds more like a, you're throwing a rock to hit him in the face. I don't know. I, w- I would take it. You could a, count it like a, the bottle hit him in the face first, and then it explodes. <laughs> in the that's an extra that's of damage, a, you know? That's a dick, dick move. Boom. You're like, boom. I mean, <laughs> he got three successes. He got all the successes, basically, he could get. Yep. Yeah, like, okay, so can we go up to five, and I'm just going to use an AP to, to, like, set him on lots of fire? <laughs> on lots of roll, fire. Roll that beautiful footage there for damage. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, shit, how do I do that again? Uh, yeah, so it should, actually, there should be a... There's there's nothing under Molotov on my gear sheet. Let me find Okay, Molotov so then there. click your character sheet. There's the damage dice in there. Whatever the number was next to your damage on your character sheet should be how many you're rolling. Uh, one sec. Damage rating four. Okay. So four and then, so five, right? Where's the five? Where's the point? Fifth? Okay. Then yes. All right. So we have five. Yeah. Points. So we're at five. Yeah. All right. Uh, wait. What did I say? Five. Yeah. Sweet. Nice. Aww. Four damage. Does it, does it have any um, damage effects? The uh, damage effects off? persistent. Yes. Okay. So uh, reminder for the wa- viewers: if uh, persistent is if one or more effects are rolled, the target suffers the weapon's damage again at the end of their next and subsequent <laughs> turns for a number of rounds equal to the number of effects rolled. Basically, which is two here. Um, uh, so he's on the dude's on fire. That's awesome. <laughs> Let's go, <laughs> David. Question. Nope. So, okay. so, the, so the, I'm sorry. The effect die is the head, not the not the double bang. Yes, the, okay. the head represents the effects. I okay. sort of have to glance at Jaeger, right, and be like, I love a goddamn barbecue. <laughs> <laughs> oh, just, just to confirm, the effect one, though, is, or the head one is a dam- one damage plus an effect. Yes, right. correct. Um, the When I was reading through Persistent, it talks about the amount of effect I rolled. That's why I was referencing, so it's... Got it. Uh, so this would be two turns. So he takes damage at the end of his turn and then two additional turns. Uh, yes, that's correct. Damn, exactly. Okay. That's awesome. Uh, yep. I'm just, he's going to be dead. There. Just close the door. <laughs> slowly close the door back. <laughs> I mean, you know what? Uh, <laughs> might be a, that he, might be a strategy. His next action is going to be to like run to the Neosporin aisle and be like, ah, <laughs> Jordan, is there a pers- for Molotov in this? Is there like a persistent, like yeah. fire field that we'll need to kind of maybe like avoid? Um, so what I've done previously, I don't know if there's, uh, actually, I think there is, let me check really quickly. I will, I will get back to you on that one, Mr. Handy. That's fine. I suppose it's not immediately relevant. So don't worry about it. Yep. No, well, I mean, it will be relevant soon. Um, <laughs> no, but I think the okay. catches on fire. <clears throat> no, that's going to no, be relevant no. soon. The Molotov doesn't show, um, like a persistent ring of fire or anything. I think it's more like. It just catches things on fire very well. Okay. It's been a dry month in the wasteland, and this place was built of balsa wood. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Um, okay. I think it is... Jaeger, anything else? I think you used up your stuff. That was a pretty good turn anyway. Yep, yep, yep. We're good. Okie dokie. i um, looking here. Environmental conditions. Hazards. Okay. It is Buck Casey's turn. Do I hear all this wild shenanigans that's happening? You're going to hear an explosion. <laughs> like, I think an explosion is so probably chill. is happening. Okay. <laughs> He's just like... <laughs> so, you see, yeah, I mean, at this point, I'm kind of just hanging around. And I'm, like, looking around, and I just hear that, that poof, right? And I turn around, I'm like, what? the hell <laughs> and i just like i just kind of grab onto my um revolver and i just start um sprinting um i'm gonna i feel like buck would have saw uh doc make his movements because he saw doc and he, he was kind of waiting around so i'm gonna go in that direction which i believe was above um like the north side of the the station so i'm gonna go this way so how far can i go jord uh so like it depends on which action you're using if you're using doing, a minor go ahead uh that's a good point because i want to do sprint as a major right or no 
Yeah, but that that could get you to where we are. Yeah, that's what and I you would do. Your revolver as uh, as your minor, right? Oh, uh, that's a good point. That's a good point. Technically, I did draw, so I would say that's a good point. So I drew, I drew, and then I'm just gonna do a movement action instead of a sprint. So I think that puts me. I moved one zone. Does this look right? Two. Two zones. You moved two zones. Uh, well, yeah, but he's, you've only moved one so far. Right. Because he so, only crossed one line. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. I didn't see in the far right there. That was a separate zone. So what's technically... So here's the second line. So I can go all the way here, right? Yes, you can. That one movement? Okay. So yeah. that's what I do. I just start sprinting back to where I kind of saw Doc run off to. Okie dokie. I love the fire graphic. Yes, thank you. Uh, that, <laughs> that is, is so David, accurate. That is a David approved graphic. Okay. It's awesome. No, I really like it. It's really great, actually. Yeah. I'm not being sarcastic. I love it. Uh, so, anyway, um, yes, that guy is definitely on fire. The door, I just want to clarify with that the door remained open, though, right? Like you just opened it and threw it in. So yeah. now, now the door is still I, open. I, right? I think I opened it and then sort of rolled out of the way to provide him with the most. Yeah, absolutely. And not get caught on fire. Yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, Buck, you're good? Yep. Yeah, I'm good. Okay, cool. And then Dead Raider is done. Uh, Sir Jack Lancaster. Uh, I, I am going to say now, in order of events, this guy probably would have turned around to see what's going on because an explosion just came from behind him. Oh, fuck right? yeah, yeah. So <laughs> he probably, it is obviously not his go yet, but he's aware that you're there. He's aware that I'm there? I mean, he would have, he was, he was facing the shelves. An explosion okay. would have come from, you know, over in, this, over in this direction here, right? So he would have turned around. You kind of get visibility to that whole area at that point. Yep. Uh, so I'm thinking he knows you're there. What are you going to do about it? I'm going to be a consummate professional and really coolly slip over the counter and use my minor action to move one zone. Um, and then hopefully to my benefit, I'm still behind the counter and I'm going to take a shot at him. What, what kind of, uh, what kind of move over the counter are we doing here? Is this fancy or anything? Or are we just doing a quick I mean, hop? just one of those uh, quick hops, like, all right. My feet over. I'll, allow, I'll allow a quick hop, but if you're going to do something fancy like sliding across a car or something like that, it's I'm like, it's not, it. dude, Jordan, it's not a white snake video. He's not like, <laughs> <pretty> <laughs> <much>. <laughs> it's, like <laughs> it's more efficient than it is cool, but in my mind, I like to think it was cool. Parkour. In, Jack's, in Jack's mind, he thinks it's cool. Yeah, I kind of yeah. let a parkour out as I do that. <laughs> <laughs> parkour! <laughs> okay. Ugh. Uh, so many 20s. So many okay. 20s. Can I oh, re-roll You that? can re-roll a damage, I think, with your luck die, right? A damage or an aim? This is the aim. Well, if you aimed, you can re-roll. He didn't aim. It's, he the minor it's, re it's re roll oh. 1d20 or 3 damage per luck point spent. Mm. So he could um, re-roll the d20. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. What, what clothing are you wearing, too? Don't you get a re-roll on one of your die for a, for a test with your clothing? Mm. Is that because he he's just a has form, he has formal clothes? Don't I don't think so. So he's casual, like, casual, casual clothing, casual clothing has a reroll on strength and agility, and I think formal clothing has a reroll on something else. It's because mm. he's a brand ambassador. That pretty boy ain't got formal no attire. Uh, I am going to spend a luck point though. Ooh. Okay. Uh, to reroll one of those. Yeah, wearing formal clothing allows a reroll on oh charisma. <laughs> 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 Not this then. <laughs> <laughs> he, he slides across the counter and goes, he pulls out a business card. Sir, Jack, <laughs> wrong, wrong thing. Say, what's up, girl? Uh, okay, Do we so want some insurance? A failure, but <laughs> one success. Yeah. So, um, okay, right, good. So I'm not charging the complication. Um, you only, it's a difficulty one check, so you still get some damage. Cool. Uh, and knowing that it wasn't the most accurate shot like my last one was. I'm glad nobody saw that. Uh, but I am going to, uh, my gun is a fire rate of two. So I'm going to spend two additional bullets and it's going to be a quick pop, pop, pop um, to basically I add for each bullet, one damage dice. So I'm going to roll two additional damage dice. 
Oh, that's not great. Okie dokie. Um, should I roll for location? Or? I was just going to say roll, roll for location, please. His left leg. <laughs> really not my best shots. Yeah. It's like not the best. Maybe you caught him in the femoral. I don't think so. <laughs> He's going to bleed out. <laughs> he says, nah. What nah. about his kneecap? Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, hold on one second. He needs to get... Maybe he dresses to the left in you. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Uh, okay, let's see here. So... Yeah, his leg. <laughs> uh, Flame Boy is on fire. Uh, he is going to attempt to put himself out. Uh, he is going, uh, how, how would he do this? Um, stop, drop, and roll. I, I mean, I was just going to say, literally, I think he's going to try I to mean, stop, in 2077, who got that message though? He probably is like, wait, is, uh, it's, uh, go back to the vault is the only yeah. answer. To <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Uh, yeah. All right. He's going to do, I think, an athletics uh, strength roll. I think that's what that is. And it's going to be a difficulty of three because he's on fire. Uh, which means that he got a complication uh, <laughs> you know, while be- trying to do it. So he's like trying, he's trying to like get on his like everything about him is just on fire. And I will say, instead of actually putting himself out, he has managed to uh, <laughs> ex- somehow the fire is burning brighter and it kind of feels like it's going to be three turns before that sucker's out. Nice. Um, and, but I but I will say we're probably getting a little. He's trying to roll, so I think he's at least catching this table on fire here. <laughs> uh, idiot. <laughs> okay, let's get some more fire here with this art. Okay, Bob Ross, here we go. And I'm just gonna add a little happy birthday right there. Okay. And he okay. takes the damage at the end of his turn. I'm gonna charge. I'm gonna charge it on Jaeger's turn because okay. that will have been a full round from. From when that had happened. Got it. Okay. Jason. I'm going to move in. And while I'm lecturing him about not reading the safety precaution, I'm going to cut his <laughs> fucking face off with my machete. Oh, my gosh. Melee right. weapons roll. Right? Any yeah. com- anything? Okay, cool. So, difficulty, yeah. difficulty one. Uh, nice. Um, so what does that mean? So that means you roll damage for stabbing. Oh, nice. Okay. Roll, roll for stab. Stab. Machete. Uh, additional dice. No. Good. Mm. I like that you can throw the dice whichever direction you like. All right. There we go. Piercing. <laughs> He's... Mm. Uh, give me, roll me one more d20 so we can figure out where you stabbed him. Uh, uh, I kind of wish that it would automatically do the agreed. damage location in there. In this Because they've automated so much of it. I know. Everything else yeah, is it's automated that's... so well. Yeah. <laughs> number yeah. two. Who in the face? Ooh, in the number head. two. In the oh, face. I did say I was going for his face, I thought. So, so he's sure. just like, whack. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, shh, stop screaming. <laughs> <laughs> So, so now he's just doing this, like his face is just now gushing while kind of on fire. Um, and uh, Melty Face manage, I'm just going to call you Melty Face because it's just my, it's fun to say. Victor uh, manages to kind of dodge out of the way of the flames as he's just kind of like going here. He hasn't dropped yet, but he is clearly on his way to heaven or wherever uh, raiders go. Okie dokie. David. All right. So um, inside is the same zone I'm in, right? I don't see dots. Uh, 
Yes. That is okay. one zone. Uh, so I think, you know, I've seen him throw in a Molotov. I've seen Victor run in. Uh, I'm probably going to follow suit because I was like a combat medic. Um, <laughs> so uh, I'm going to go, uh, you know, there's my cue and uh, run in. Um, so qu question, um, you know, in D and D you kind of place your character on a specific location and you can't really like occupy the same place as another person, but here it's all about zones. So like, can I, can, can I actually melee the, the guy on fire or is it like, would Victor be like blocking me here? No, it, it, it seems to be from what I can tell. I mean, I like tap him on the shoulder and say, Hey, back up buddy. It's my turn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> can I cut in? Yeah. Yeah. Pardon me, <laughs> Doc. I was, yeah, no. No, I, I don't, can, I don't hey, think so. Jordan, Unless, can we get a bigger view now that we're all in here just to see what we're working with? Because maybe his question yes. is mute. He could just go one square around me um, or some shit. Well, so to, to your left and right are closed doors. So this is kind of a, a tight hallway. So oh, there really okay. isn't uh, a lot that's in there. I will yeah. give you at least maybe the remainder of this room. So that is the entirety of the room, oh, but there's okay. doors, there's doors closed on either side, <coughs> but it's cool for me to oh, attack. Well lit. Uh, yes, I'm going to allow that. All right. In that case, I'm going to take an aim minor action. Um, and then attack. So I just want to clarify one thing, David, what are you using? Cause I should say if I'm it's sorry. melee, if it's melee, then yes. Oh, wow. But so yeah, yeah. Okay. That's good then. Because I so think does there Mr. Are Handy that... never have to draw something. He's always just got his buzzsaw at the ready <laughs> and laser gun. Surprise! Yeah. And, and you sir. jealous? You jealous, Jaeger? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, I, okay. I did kind of say that outside on my last turn. I was like, I raise my buzzsaw and kind of get it ready because I had nothing else to do. Um, yeah. So either way, anyway. Okay, so I'm going to attack. Uh, so with the buzzsaw, and let's see. Oh, now I did aim so I can reroll one, right? Yes. And we said that we're just going to click the weapon again and choose like the first dice, right? That cool? Yep. yep. All right. All right. So I didn't hit anything, but I didn't kill myself. You so did. Your saw is definitely feeling a little warm, though. Like you, <laughs> you took it past there and it's just like. It's also around a bunch of fire. Right. But, uh, but yeah, uh, I'll take I imagine you're trying to protect Mr. Handy from the fire while attacking. It's, it's, different. I mean, he's like rotated, you know, he's like rotated on the backside here while the, the, the buzz saw is like, you know, here and stuff. So, yep. Uh, I, I guess that's my turn because I'm a terrible combat medic. I'm much better at the medic part than the combat. Jaeger. Cool. Uh, yeah, I guess I'm gonna. So wait, we said that was all one zone? Yeah. So how does how does like exploratory movement work? Because I don't like obviously I want to get in and get in on the fight, but there's not enough room for me to jump in here. Well, I said if there's Malay, right, that it'd be fine. Yeah, it, Malay Malay is fine. I mean, it, it's it's tight, but now nah, he's about to cook. I'm more worried about clearing like clearing the room. I'm not I'm ignoring him as a threat and moving on to. Yeah, so if you're if you're gonna if you're gonna run through it, I would probably. Oh, actually, hold on. First off, let's resolve the the damage. Can you uh, do the damage for the guy? Let's just see. Yeah, uh, it was four base, right? Yeah. Yes. Oh, do you have to reroll every time? It's so because it's persistent, David. He gets charged for a number of rounds. I, okay, I just figured it was the same amount that he rolled the first time. But okay. <laughs> Um, I guess that's true. I could double check that. No, because I don't think it, it wouldn't be like one damage every turn if I rolled one the first time, would it? I would uh, think it's four damage dice worth of damage every time. That's kind that's of like, what I was thinking. That's, that, no worries, no worries. The chat is going to fillet us later. <laughs> we'll deserve it. We'll deserve it. Our, our community is so forgiving. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's fine. Uh, okay, nice. Uh, he finally, bleedy face and all, collapses onto the floor just like face first. So there is just this kind of flaming corpse now that is just prone up against uh, this kind of shelf situation that is that is over here. So uh, dude, I, I, I think I have to just, as I didn't take a free act. Hey, that's a hot tamale. <laughs> 
<laughs> When's lunch? <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. So corpse is on fire. Table is on fire. Um, so if you're going to try to move through it, Jaeger, so now that it's the beginning of your turn, um, you're going to have to be aware of the, the fire hazards. Uh-huh. So I would say to move through, I probably would make you do a skill test. Um, so I was trying... So, so you're, you're going to have to like jump... If you want to try to jump over the flames to get past No, skip there. around. Isn't this a door? Like where, where my token is? Yeah, it's a closed door, so you can definitely open it. Because we can't. Oh wait, can we see like over this? Is this is this open? So this you should. Or is this able, a wall? You should be able to see up to here. Um, this is this is wall. This is wall, and this is wall. Okay, then I'm just gonna move. I'm gonna move uh, to this door, and minor action, draw my my baseball bat, and yep. ready a response. If that door opens, I'm going to clock whatever's on the other side. Okay. Small child opens the door. <laughs> <laughs> no danger of children. Stop breaking the rules, John. You shouldn't have been hanging out with Raiders. Oh, my God. I mean, like, yeah, but true. Um, <laughs> Do you guys ever watch The Whitest Kids You Know? Where he's just like, uh, what are you doing? Ah, my pants are dead. And he's just going around doing crazy things, like hitting things with hammers. <laughs> Hey, kid, what are you doing? Why aren't you in school? My parents are dead. <laughs> anyway, uh, enough kids with their parents <laughs> We're jokes. like, no, Jordan, <laughs> just nope, you. Just You're the <laughs> only person that watched that episode. <laughs> You're That's the whitest true. kid we know, so. That's also true. <laughs> uh, Okie dokie. So, in fact, that door does open. Uh, and I... Nice. Going to give you... Good timing. Uh, a view and oh, it, honestly, it, it honestly was so this guy is on the other side of it give him a fleck let's go oh wait shit how many difficulty difficulty one sweet the thwackening look another <laughs> dick face right there on the other side of the door where's i've gone blind there it is nice Boom. action point Boom. Nice. Get show me, flagged. show me the damage. Uh, which was three for this? Why is that not on my character sheet? Yes, it is. I'm dumb. It's four. Nice. Uh, roll one more d20 for hit location. Ah, oh, right. Nuts. <laughs> Dick points. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's just an arching like undercut that just oh my gosh nice uh okay what was that three arm, arm it looks yeah, like left arm <laughs> left arm okay so somehow i swing across my body <laughs> and... nice uh, parkour okay. very nice very nice um, anyway, that's going to catch him off guard, honestly. And I think he would pretty much be, be stunned. Like Wait. he was getting ready to run in there and you just thwack him with the bat. I'm not thinking <laughs> that he's very useful after that. Uh, Buck. All right. So I see everybody going to go around inside as I'm here in the corner. So, you know, I kind of follow suit and see everything. I hear all this stuff and I'm in the corridor where everybody else is. And I'm just like, what is that smell? I could like see the 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 ashes and, and flames of whatever was there before dinner. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are having a lot of fun without me. I, mean, I kind of like I still have my my revolver raised. Um, Jaeger's doing his thing. Um, you know, Jordan. This is like a tight corridor now. Now there's like four of us in here. What is my what is my line of sight here in terms of like? the person that I, you're just smash right? yeah, I don't think you would see him like when you're coming okay. around the corner there you kind of see Jaeger like with an arm through the door um, but I'm thinking you don't see the guy on the other side of it your best okay. guess what's going on there just so this is body. why this is this is why I was asking about cover last time because if he could see him and wanted to shoot am I 
like the cover. So if he misses, is he hitting me? He'll be yeah. fine. He'll be I, fine, boy. I do. Th- I do think there is yeah. something we'd have to sort through there if that's the case. But like. Just real world wise, like probably wouldn't shoot through a door you can't see when your friend Speak is for in yourself. The middle. <laughs> Speak for yourself. Friend I'm a is professional. a professional. Listen, <laughs> I shot a rad roach. Off, I shot a rad roach off of Victor's foot last time, so I can do anything at this point. Um, now you've done it. Now you've done it. Yeah. Now every roll is going to be a critical failure. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm going to thread uh, the needle and just get pinged in the back of the head. <laughs> yeah. Um, as, a, as a reminder, so there, there was a door on the left, but these over here are also, this is, there's doors here. If that was not clear, there are doors right here. Oh, there's three doors on the right? Oh, I did not realize. Door and that's not clear. <laughs> we did not realize. <laughs> no, you can't uh, do that. Okay. Uh, okay. That's, that's my... Helpful. That's my blind problem because I can't, I can't see. Uh, right. It's hard to tell what is fog of war well, and what isn't see. quite fog of war. Yeah. 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 It is rough. Well, but the walls are black, right? They blend right in. So that's. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh, fog of war. I'll make it slightly darker. <laughs> and I'm yeah. like, Oops. can they see that? Okay. Yes. So anyway, those are doors right there. Okay. Um, that does change my like perspective, right? So if I see everybody kind of in this corridor, and I'm a little bit bugs a little bit jealous that all this action has happened without him. You know, he was yeah. out here waiting this whole time and all this shit is happening. Um, so he's going to, he's going to look at the door. Um, and I don't know what the action is. I guess I, I'm going to try to open that door. That's right here. Well, you've already used a move action to move. Yeah. Um, so your minor, if you used your minor action already, then um, I can't can use another minor for a major or no, I think you'd have to use an action point for um, using another We've got no, him in the pool. I don't think there's a. We've got him in the pool though. Conversion. Yeah. Fuck, use him. Oh, yeah. We got we got him in the pool, man. We've been earning him. Yeah. I mean, or you can ready in action, just like uh, Jaeger. Yeah. I initially was gonna ready for an action, but if I if Buck saw a door, he's gonna try to try to bust that door open. Or, uh, or rallying's always an option as well. No, nah, Buck, Buck's not rallying here. There ain't nothing to rally about. He ain't the so rallying type. <laughs> he, he's ready to bust in, so I will take an AP. And to take an additional minor action. All right, so we got five again, I think. Yep. Okie dokie. Uh, you are going to bust this door open and you are ready to blow the head off of all of the trash in the storage closet. Dang it! If any of that stuff moves <laughs> whatsoever, <laughs> then it's going to get it. Can I just paint the scene that, you know, Buck just like kicks it right with his like his, his boot, <laughs> doors wide open. He's like ready with his revolver and he's just like, Damn it! <laughs> and that's pretty much that's pretty much my turn. <laughs> oh my gosh, well, that's wild. Okay, dead guy doesn't go. All right, so um, the the raider across the way is going to raise. Uh, he's pulling out a, a pipe gun that he's got. Uh, that's going to be his minor, and he's going to try to take a a pot shot at you, Mister Lancaster. What's your defense? Two. He can try. He can over my dead body. Uh, hey, hey, Jordan. Uh, yes. It would be helpful in the future if you wouldn't mind, since there's multiple enemies in the board, of just letting us kind of know. Maybe I missed it, but like specifically which one, if you could like almost like ping or something. Oh, uh, sorry. I thought it highlights. If, if, you, if you hover over the one in your turn tracker. Uh, will it, will the, it highlight? Yeah. yeah. If, it if will. All click. right. Never mind. Cool. Yeah. yeah that's, that's, that works really well. There, there's, something, there's something that I forget. I forget that it's Jason's screen that's showing, not mine. So, like, sometimes I am pinging, right? So, it's Jason's in the, I think, right? Or do you see it, Jason? Like, no, I'm it's, hovered it's, over it's, it's in the stream, but when you ping, we see the ping. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. But, looking- but, I, but I'm hovering. You don't see my hover, right? No. 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 Oh, okay. Damn. Okay. But looking at turn order, that works totally fine. I didn't realize it would actually highlight. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yes, the one in front of Lancaster right now. Uh, so he is going to pull it out. So you said difficulty was what, John? Two. Two. All right. Let's see here. So I've got, uh, hold on. Well, let me redo my math here. Uh, I've got one success. Um, all right. So he's trying to take a shot at you and it's land, It's flying. It's flying by. Uh, and it's Excellent. now your go. He just missed. Is it a minor action to dust my shoulders off at all? Those things How long are you going to do it for? If so, <laughs> like if it's a while, seconds. then I'm going to charge you an interact. <laughs> like three minutes, he's just, just brushing the shoulders. Uh, 
No, honestly, at this point, I've got one guy shooting at me. I got hit in the head already. I'm not doing my best at shooting the second round. I don't see any of my companions that were, you know, hired to go on this mission with me. But I do hear a lot of screaming in the back. You so heard I'm an explosion that, as well. Yeah, I'm hoping that's going well for us, but I'm still not confident since I see no one around me. Uh, so I am going to take a minor action to aim, and I am going to spend an action point to add a d20 to my dice pool uh, for the shot. Okay. Um, just because I want to make sure I survive this. British in the front, party in the back. So, so I get to re-roll one of those. So I'm going to re-roll the 20. Uh, let's see. 20. Uh, okay, so two successes. Nice. And Well, hold on. Hold on, though. Isn't, it's still three successes. The 20 was you were re-rolling the complication. That was the 20. Yeah. So it's a tag. Your yeah. small guns is a tag skill, and you rolled a two. Which yeah. means that oh the, right yeah right yeah so so you still have three successes there yeah okay so three so, successes yes so we get two AP so we're at seven yes uh, I just correct. spent we're one at six. So we're at six. Oh, you spent one I'm sorry that's yep. right you're right yep. uh, I'm not uh, I'm not going to add ammo to this one I'm going to just try to be the precise single shot oh uh, sorry that did that add any no it didn't so yeah, three. Anyway. Three damage. Okay. Yep. Three oh, damage. And roll 20. This is what we're using as a software. In the head. And yes. Yep. So he's, he's, you're grazing him on the head right here, and he clearly gets disoriented as he gets taken aback. So he's kind of doing this like Looney Tunes style, like cuckoo, cuckoo. Perfect. Uh, of what's going on there, but he still seems to be on his feet. Uh, okie dokie. Uh, that guy's on fire and no longer exists. Victor. So he's dead. <laughs> so tell me when you say no longer exists, is he, is he, is he his, his corpse is actively charring right now. <laughs> okay. Like in front of you on the floor. So yeah, he's not convulsing. He is just like dead burned and just, you're watching him cook like a hot dog. That you forgot about. So, so I glance over um, Jaeger's shoulder, right? Because he's there at that door. So, can I sort of do a over the shoulder chop at this guy without endangering Jaeger? Or yeah, let me just double check on the obstacles really quickly. Let's see, because he might count as an obstacle. Man, man, man. Yeah, positioning this game is a little bit weird. It is. It's meant to. Um, it's meant to make things easier, ironically enough, to have to be like, oh, yeah, you don't have to worry about some stuff. But when it gets to be close quarters stuff, yeah, um, it does get... Um, it's great if you're in open field. Yes. I think this is one of those like game makers fallacies where they're like, oh, we won't provide rules so it'll simplify things. And then the people who like to play these games are like, no, no, <laughs> we need the <laughs> rules. <laughs> Yeah, I think I, ju I think I just increased the difficulty, Jason. Okay, what does that mean for me when I try to chop his fucking schnoz off? Uh, yeah, so now it's, it's a difficulty two instead of a difficulty oh, one. Just, oh, God, okay, that sucks, but all right, I'm doing this. Um, I'm gonna... Jaeger, get out of the way so he can chop the schnoz. <laughs> I'm going to roll the dice right between Jaeger's legs like this. Like, ooh. Um, no. Oh, my God. Hey! There we go. Two successes. Two successes. I, I'm like, let me get a little of this motherfucker, and I just and I uh, roll for damage, right? So yep. Let me see with machete. I learned from playing Fallout 4 on Xbox again after all these years that the tire iron is the preferred weapon until you're like super far along. Sadly, I didn't equip myself with one. I got one just in case. You never know. Uh, what the fuck did I just roll? Is Not that, the right thing. We no. want damage dice. Oh, yeah, I hit I hit machete and it came up. That's you want you want to click the damage dice next to the machete. Shit, you're right. Sorry. You know what? I'm gonna let. Also, that was again. a baseball bat and not a machete. I know. Uh, yeah, that was just me having a stroke. Hang on. <laughs> There you That's go. also not. No, so no, I, I, because I had he, already. He did it. He did it to get the thing. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. 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 I, he did it to get the thing. I, I was okay. I was ahead of you. Two. Oh, good. Two. Like I yeah. had hoped. I, Give I, me one more D twenty, Jason. Oh, see nice. where this is at. I'm gonna trim his eyebrows for him. What am I gonna do here? Um, roll D twenty. 
Hello? Seven. I hit him right in the seven. You hit him right upside his seven. On the chest. Uh, which is going to be the torso, right? Yep. Earlobe. Mm, okay. Um, which is fun. Like, yeah, this is, this is where hit locations also gets weird because it's like, all right, I'm trying to picture how you're managing to hit him in the chest with the machete getting around Jaeger. Yeah, but no, you do it. He, I, I, under, under Jaeger's arm, he used to have an Audi, but that shit's been trimmed <laughs> off. That shit's like, <laughs> oh my God. like he is smooth now. Shit. He doesn't die or anything, does he? Probably no, not. he does not. No. Nope. He does not. But he is really mad. Cool. That's uh, okay. <laughs> in pain. Dr. Mr. Handy. All right. I mean, MD puppetry. I, I feel like there's not really a way that I could also malay this guy with two people trying to hit him at a door. It does seem so, quite far fetched. That's right. going to be quite difficult. So I'm going to, I'm, I'm going to say that I'm probably close, uh, to, can I ping on the map at all? Uh, the door yeah, south of me, the door, the door right below yeah. me, not yeah. the one that was. Yeah. yeah my we bug. see it. Yeah. We see it. All right. So I'm going to, uh, you know, open that door and kind of move on in. Um, what do I see, Jordan? Yep. So uh, you see what looks like the general manager of the Red Rockets office uh, that was long ago vacated. Um, so no, no dangers seem to be in here. Can you? Um, yeah, I got to reveal. Yep, 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 yep. So you're going to just say the GM of the Red Rockets is sitting there. Yep, he's just Waiting like, hey, what are you guys doing? What you the hell are you doing at my gas station? <laughs> I'm expecting an order of diesel in 20 minutes. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, Mr. Handy looks a little sad. As oh. and, and that's the end of my turn. <laughs> we wanted to murder. <laughs> uh, you okay hope, there, Jason? I every time, David, <laughs> every fucking time, David His says... Night goes, no, I'm drinking. He's like, Mr. Handy, dot, dot, dot. It's always something <laughs> weird, and I'm in the middle of a good... <laughs> Thank you, David. Uh, Jaeger. Uh, yeah, I'm going to hit this guy again. Uh, so I guess, how does aim work with a, with a melee weapon? Does it, does it still count? You just squint your eyes real hard. I, <laughs> mm, <laughs> like, I might as well use see. a minor action, right? No, I think it says it. It, it says first attack roll you make this turn. So maybe it's just batter up, you know, yeah. you're ready. And yep. Let's go. I'm stepping focused. into that swing. It's only cool if you do that ass wiggle before you swing. <laughs> if you're just like. <laughs> uh, let's see. Big way to. So wait, does that add an additional die or just the re-roll? It allows it's a you re to re-roll. It's a re-roll. Re-roll, that's right. The AP will give you the additional. One success. What? Uh, but you get to re-roll the 15. Right. Yeah, but it's a difficulty one anyway. It's, well, is it worth re-rolling because well, the 20 AP, is an though. AP? You can yes, get an AP. Right? Yes, you, so, could. you could roll a complication. That you could there. roll a complication. Uh, roll a complication. God, take I the mean, chances, like, man. That's never happened, right? <laughs> <laughs> Only a five percent <laughs> chance. No. There you go. That's a critical. Uh, and I was about to say that's a tag. That's your tag one, right? Yeah. So that's, so that's two AP. Uh, so we got two, two action points. So we're at uh, eight. eight. Oh, nice. Uh, so Four can I bring it down to seven go. and add a uh, add a damage die? Yep. All right, we're at seven. Generate oh, one and yeah. crush smack him. him harder. Forehead to crotch. Slice him. Do it. Nice. Uh, uh, he's going down. Talk to me about what's happening as you play it through. Oh, right in the head. In the head. Oh, yeah. So this is just a full on, like, the natural, just stepping up to the plate and just right to the temple. Right to the temple. And his, oh. his head just kind of clicks sideways. Like some cottage cheese shoots out his ear and shit. You're just like, <laughs> ah, like, oh. His head clicks sideways and it's just whap backwards. Uh, nice. Man. Fantastic. He goes, he does a literal spin and then just. <laughs> nice. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, let's see here. Uh, he's dead. Buck. I'm upset, but I, um, 
Do I? Can I see any of that action that just happened there? Can I see any of that? Uh, I mean, you would have seen probably the tip of the bat going into <laughs> to the swing. Maybe and I you, just you definitely like, saw Victor it. like trying to yeah, stick I was about his to say, arm. Maybe, maybe I just hear that that like swinging like the. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Uh, Buck just like hears that crack and is just like, "Dang it, y'all are having more fun than me." He's like kind of getting pissed off that that's happening. Um, there's really not much that Buck's doing here. Corridor's still tight. He still smells the barbecue that happened earlier. Um, yeah, it smells for sure. Yeah, it smells. I see Mr. Handy. I see Doc going one door. Um, but that's pretty much it. So, um, I think at this point, Buck's trying to see, you know, at, from the visibility of, of, of what he can see, you can see that there's not a route this way. So he's going to be like, I'm just, I'm going to find out where the real fun is. And he's, he's just going to, he's going to move around. So he's going to cut this way. Okay. And so try to a, circle. Okay. So you're still in the zone or no? I'm still in the zone, but I'm going to go to, I'm going to, that's zone one, right? I'm still in the same so zone. So you're still in the same I, zone. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to do this. Okay. Uh, do I still have movement? Inside yeah. that, that first half of the, of the gas station is the same zone. So this is all, this is all the same zone. Yeah. Yep. Okay. I'm probably realistically, I, I'd go about like here. I'd kind of peek in and then I'd, I'd go over and I, I could see. Um, yeah. You can see Jack shooting at this radar across the way. Yeah. Um, all of that movement was still minor, right? Uh, you went two zones or one zone? One, one, zone, zone. Is, one zone. One zone is minor, yeah. Okay. So. Kill steel. Kill steel. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty. Son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah. I mean, as much as Buck would love to just steal this kill right in front of Pretty Boy's face. Uh, it's a little, you know, internally bug knows that's kind of, that's pretty far. That's far shot. Unless that's still considered, this is where the range is. This is not, is that close range or is that mid range? This is not close. Mid. Mid. Yeah. 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 So, um, at this point he kind of sees what's going on. I think Buck would kind of tuck under the, um, kind of under the countertop there. He would kind of just hide, hide near the countertop. And, um, Let's see. I probably would just ready at this point. I'd kind of tuck in and I would just ready and, 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 um, wow. Yeah, I guess I would ready in your zone. Yeah. And if he comes, if he gets in that close range, I'm just ready to kind of turn out and pop at him. Okay. That would be, do we, do we get visibility since he's just kind of tucking in, looking around, you know, can we see if there's anybody else to that other side? Yeah, like so if you're, I was going to say, so you are looking around there, Buck? Yeah, I am. Yeah. That so, I am, that's true. Yeah, so you can kind of see an empty space that's over this way. It does look like there is um, a door that leads okay. over here. It's got a sign on it that says, uh, women. <laughs> <laughs> he sprints to the door. Like, oh, hell yeah. Yay. Ladies. My kind of party. Your, your hero has arrived. Uh, <laughs> uh, sounds good. Yeah, that's where Buck's that's where Buck's at. He's he's uh ready and up if, if that guy gets close, he's gonna kapow. Awesome. Okie dokie. Uh that guy is dead. All right, so uh this guy just took a shot to the head. And he is somehow in his day is going to try to like pop off another one. Um, I'm going to use, um, I think it would be more difficult, but I'm going to use some of my GM action points essentially to kind of negate that uh, difficulty. Cool. I'm going to charge myself there and he's going to try to get one off on you. That's a dick move. Reasonable. Uh, raising hand, dick move. <laughs> just no, no. I was just say, that's reasonable. <laughs> no. Oh God. I don't know what I'm doing. You deal with clients, though. You're like, that's reasonable. <laughs> totally. Everything's reasonable. I know. <laughs> Dick move. Sorry. Don't hurt Bob. Yeah. Why don't I know how to do things? Because you're the blue shell of people. 
<laughs> Shut up, John. <laughs> Uh, okay, yes, and uh, hold on, this was my raider. Oh, I have an eight, so I've got a one success, so I do not hit again. So he's just like, oh, burr. so he like shoots the gun off, it breaks some glass that's probably behind you, um, which does not, you know, ricochet and hit you. Um, what are you gonna do? He's missed twice now. I kind of glance over my shoulder because I could have sworn I saw Buck come in, but then like disappear behind the counter. Uh, nice of you to join us, I guess. <laughs> and then I'm going to spend an action point. So we're down to six, uh, aim and try to finish this guy off a little more, um, uh, professionally. And now that I have an audience here too, um, I'm scared. I'm really, steal the I'm kill. really feeling the pressure at this point. Uh, so what does the action point here do? It gives you another dice. Yeah. Basically it just yeah. makes it more likely that I'll okay. actually hit him. Man, I'm rolling a lot of 20s. So, so what Jeez. happens in this scenario where it's like, it was an extra dice, but it was a complication. Can you ignore still, it? Yeah, I mean, he's still, no, it's still, he gets a reroll because you ah, aimed, right, John? Or, yes. Yeah. Luckily. If he did, If he didn't have the aim, then it would be charged the complication. Gotcha. Thank you. Yep. So that is a double success. So we get one AP back because he only takes one to hit. Why didn't I see? Where did you see the double success? I don't like my Wait, he rolled three. a three. He rolled, rolled a, three a three on the uh, reroll. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Okay, yes. Um, wait, no, I'm still dumb here. No, you had zero successes. And I then had you zero successes. The and then the success. three is but a that, that lowers it. That lowers it one. So you have to get a two or a one, right? Not a, not a three. I thought it was that or below. It's equal it, to something. It's equal to. Um, it's not just two, right? It's it's equal to. A, I a thought thing. that's what the three was. Sorry, 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 small sorry, guns sorry. three. Were you saying? Were you saying a critical success? Though? So like, I could see one success, so, but not two, right? Well, because it's a, I got a three, and it's a tag skill that counts as two successes, right? Actually, uh, pretty sure. Yes. What determines if it's a two or a three? That's uh that's the. I thought. Question. Hold on. Let's just double check it there, because I thought the tag skill just lowers your critical success threshold. But you actually might be right. Actually, well, I I think that's the right. same thing. A critical so, right. success. So his is critical two success successes. is a three. Yeah, it's just hitting at a three, right? Instead of a one or two. Okay, I'll allow it. Let's go. But originally, a critical success is just one, not one or two. It, honestly, for the sake of this actual particular thing, it doesn't matter because he's going to get a hit. It's just about whether it's going to be an action point or not. Okay. Um, yeah, and I, I think they're we're just using the same terminology differently. Like I think it's the same thing. Tag skill is the same as when, critical success. When using a tag skill, you score a critical success on any die which rolls equal to or under the skill's rank. So if Perfect. he's rank three, okay, it's the rank. Like, yeah. okay. uh, that was going, so if you're like rank five, yeah, you're killing it. I'm gonna spend one additional shot uh, as well, just to, you know, the good old double tap method, because again, I have an audience and I have pressure and I wanna <laughs> make sure I kill this guy. He's really trying to get that kill, I'll tell you. He's like shoots one earlobe, the other earlobe, <laughs> and then Bug comes in chewing his fucking, and it's like, I got this. I can't. Yep. Oh, uh, show me where. D20. Right, right, right leg. leg. <laughs> Shot him in the left leg, shot him in the head, shot him in the right leg. It's a yeah, flesh so wound. It like, it, it blows open, uh, I'm not a doctor, some critical vein in his knee. Uh, I'm not a doctor, but I play one on Twitch. Oh, no, it's his uh, knee vein. It's his knee vein. I've seen it. Yeah. Yep. Seen it. Fine. You got the big old knee vein and he's like bleeding really fast. And like, he was barely conscious as it was. So he's like, Ugh. and he just like falls down and basically bleeds out in front of you. Definitely did that on purpose. <laughs> yep, definitely. I want yes, uh, to make an interesting form. I blow my gun. <laughs> <laughs> I might charge the you uh, right the a knee point for that. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. Uh, that is my turn. Okay. Right, just to double check, we're at six, right? Because he regenerated yep. one after spending one. Okay. I just want to make sure I've got one right. Uh, oh, we're yeah. at seven. Sure. Yeah. I thought yeah. we were at seven. I after the regeneration. No, so wait. Because he spent uh, one, which took us to six, but then he got two back. Because it was, because uh, he rolled a. No, no. you're right. But it, it still would have put it to seven because he got an extra AP back. I thought we were at six going into this turn. No? 
Yes. We were at six. I okay. spent one, but I got one back. So we're at six is what I had. Okay. Matt says six. Um, all right. So as of now, so you guys seem to have cleared out, you know, all of your perceived dangers right now. So we're actually going to drop turn order and we're going to kind of enter free rounds here. So Jordan, is there a door say there ish? Can you see uh, that? From from where you're at, um, no. So how this does is, one get to the staff area from back here? Like, um, run all the way around. I think. Yeah, you you don't technically the way that I I kind of played it out. Oh, sweet. So is there like a? I don't know. So your your room right now is kind of closed off. There's the there's the three doors that you see. There's the back door, and then there's the one that Jaeger's standing in that you can go through. There's yeah. There's still one door that's remained to be open technically right there. Right I'm gonna here. go. Yeah, I'm gonna women. I'm gonna go in this room no, here. No, that's a different door. <laughs> oh, okay. So this this one right here is. Oh yeah, that one. I see. Right? Yeah, right, right, right. I'm with you. I imagine I wouldn't go down the hallway over the fire. Okay, so, so I'm gonna so, go into the other room. Yep. So you enter uh, the room where that guy was. Um, it basically looks like this was the car mechanic part. The doors are down. Oh shit! Um, okay. And so this is where they used to do the oil changes and whatnot. There's broken racks that are there. A couple of really weird old tires, um, mm. but no other baddies that are going in here. Okay. I, I guess I stomp out the burning corpse, you know, because I don't want it to get burnt. We might need yeah, to I eat was it. Gonna, I was going to ask that question, right? Like yeah. the table's still technically on fire. And the corpses. Like, no, I don't worry about the table. I'm just the, 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 the meat, right? So I just knock yeah. it over and just kind of stomp on it and we let it, you know. Yeah. Um, I'll, I'll mosey into that door to the south there. Okay. Uh, the one that's right by the body. Yeah. Yep. Um, so you go in here, this looks like it's kind of just a, a quick place with a microwave, what used to be a microwave, you know, and where they would do their kind of quick, uh, oh. meals and stuff like that. Yeah. So but, I can cook the parts of the body or whatever to make if sure. You, I don't, if you want, maybe if the microwave's cooked. still working. Hell, you could take it. It's a portable healing machine for you. It's radiation, <laughs> baby. <laughs> <laughs> on an outlet and stick your arm in there. I, I, I think Dr. <laughs> Dr. Mr. Handy is hovering over me, giving me medical advice. I'm like, oh shit, I didn't have <laughs> to pay Put it over your copay. head like a helmet. Yeah, I'm going to... I'm gonna. Is it a small one so I can bring it with us? A nuka wave? Does it <laughs> you work? You cannot take it. It does not work. <laughs> what else is in here? No. A coffee machine? Some coffee pods? What the uh, fuck, Jordan? Come on. Yeah. Yeah. There's a. Uh, I take all that. <laughs> I put it in my inventory. Oh my god. So it's one of those are, are like we... 1950s microwaves, so it takes up like literally the entire room. So so you can. So Jason, if you do want to do that, there are rules for scavenging. So you can scavenge the room if you want, well, which you know, I think is what I Michael really was just do. about to ask about. Yeah, I really yep. want to do that hardcore. How do I do that? Okay. As it to himself with the power cord. So it <laughs> is a roll that I'm looking up. I think it's perception. Uh, uh, perception and survival. Yeah. I'll have survival. And everyone else assisting. How does that work? So I have survival as a skill. Yep. It, it's specifically in the book. It says searching requires a perception survival test with a difficulty determined by the location's degree. So it's basically is kind of like how searched is the room already okay. uh, and how long am I searching it for? Okay. Right. So you've got to kind of specify like how long are you going through this room to kind of gather some things? I'm, look, um, I, honestly, so so I've been here before. Uh, I've been this road before, if you will. I'm looking yep. for things like th there's a there's a corpse out there that I can. I'm going to eat it. Munch so, yeah. Yeah. For so, sure. So I want some salt. Uh, like, like this is, a, where's the break room? I want the salt packets. I want the pepper yeah. packets. If there's some sriracha, I'm going to eat. I'm going to fuck it. Mm. Okay. So I'm looking for the crafting items, the common and uncommon like materials. Right, right, right. That's dumb. That's dumb. I want to eat like a king. I want to eat okay. this. Who is this? What's his name? Do you think? I think I like <laughs> think he had a name tag on no, him. His oh. oh yeah. He, he, no, the rate no, he's not an employee. He was a raider. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Marcy the the methed out like fucking counter person. That we, no, like yeah, I'm gonna eat this guy. Oh my god. You okay, so his wallet. Poor so Jason, Herman. give me give me perception survival. All right, what does that mean? So I'm, pardon me, because I play ten ten yeah. So I have do I have to roll perception survival separately or what? How's if it? you go under click on survival on your on your yeah. character sheet and it, that rolls uh, no, no, no. Wait, it, it, rolls it goes it rolls no. endurance. 
Do quick roll. No, do quick roll at the top left next to the little head, the D20 icon, and you can do the number of dice, the okay. attribute, and Got the it. skill. Thank you. Oh. So two dice, two uh, D20. One. I forgot about that thing. One or it's, two. It's always it's always two, right? Perception. By default. Yeah. Okay, two it. default. That's really sexy. Thanks for whoever made this character sheet. Uh, perception survival. Going to roll it. Hey, what's that Going to aim it at Jaeger. Whoop. Oh, I hit him. Uh, what's that mean? Nice. One, one success. Yeah, by the way, difficulty was one. So, um, Did it. I will give you a couple salt packets. <laughs> Wait. Uh, for let me say it. Jaeger. Mayonnaise. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, oh, so I get God. some salt. How many salt packets do I get? Uh, you can have uh, some Heinz mayonnaise. I'll give you uh, two packets of from, Heinz mayonnaise. From what year? Uh, Please just tell me what's the best if, <laughs> if eaten by. What's oh, it? my God. Best, <laughs> best if by 2070. <laughs> they're, they're rocks. They're, we're they're in just tw- solid. We're in 22. <laughs> my favorite. I'm not wait, uh, but I'm not immune to some fucking mayo though. I can you, uh, <laughs> you actually have to grate the mayo like cheese. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I mean everything else about you is melting. Why isn't what comes out of your rear? So yeah. you know, just eat it. <laughs> so I think I think I've got some supplies, and I'm gonna I'm gonna you know carve out the the important muscles that matters, like you know a ham, let's say from oh, uh, God. this guy. Okay, so uh, Damn, Jason man. is spending time taking out some food out of the corpse after finding some stuff. I was uh, butcher knife. Jaeger, it sounded like you wanted to scavenge something as well. What were you trying? Yeah, I'm looking for more like uh, common and uncommon materials, like crafting shit, so I can make more Molotovs. Yep, okay. I um, get a gas station to go figure. Give me... Hell yeah! <laughs> give me a... They chose the, the wrong symbol. place. Sure. Uh, perception survival difficulty one one burp, burp, burp. yep oh, one I'm um, just kind of taking a look here um, alright I'm going to roll on the fancy chart here I found some stiff alright um, you find ten Bobby pins. Ten bobby pins? Nice. Yeah. Wait. You get for picking locks. Oh, okay. Ten uh and it, they actually have a damage indicator with them. I don't know what that's about, but it's a ten plus five ah. damage bobby pins. <laughs> Sweet. I'm a step. I have a lot I have a lot of questions about a plus five bobby pin. I'm well, not gonna lie about guy. it. I'm not gonna lie about it, but uh, so can I throw them like knives? I Bobby wonder, pin. and I have not admittedly read a lot in the crafting session, but I wonder if it's like shrapnel that you put into bombs or something like that. And it yeah, or like a it. nail gun, but a bobby is, pin yeah, gun or something. Hell yeah. I'm just curious, what like table did you get that off of? Like how I thought I'd be finding like common or uncommon materials to craft with. So, so. in uh, 208 and the the rule book. So it is my random oddities and valuables. Oh, wait. So how do I find, like, materials? Do I have to, like, disassemble? Ca- I mean, it kind of it kind of specifies on, like, what I say is kind of located in the area, right? Gotcha. So, um, dim, 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 dim. anybody else? What else is going on? Buck, what are you doing over there? Yeah, you going to the so, ladies' room? No, nah, I'm not going to the ladies' room because I ain't got to pee or nothing. I'm, uh... So I see, uh, you know, after witnessing that whole action there with the uh, pretty boy, you know, I kind of, you know, I look to the guy to to my left. I see he's dead. I look over and see the last, you know, shot of pretty boy. And um, I kind of just glance at him. I'm a little jealous internally, but, you know, I just look at him and I'm just like, oh, you've been paying attention to my shots. OK, you're doing pretty good. And I kind of just try to brush it off. Um and then uh, after that, I'm pretty just uh, um, I'm just looking around as well. Uh, I'm looking for for two things, and forgive me because I haven't really looked at all the crafting stuff as well. Uh, but I'm looking for caps, uh, as we all are. Um, but then I'm also just trying to see if there's uh, this. This might go to what Jaeger's saying, right? Like yeah. I'm looking for materials um, for me my focus is like weapon crafting 
Um, but I don't know if, you know, I don't know if that really matters here if I'm just looking around and I'm kind of, you know, to paint the RP picture, I'm just like carelessly, like kind of just kicking shit over, like looking behind yep. the counters, like, you know, super casual. Yep. Um, give me, Oh, sorry, Jordan. Yeah. I think, I think the plus five damage dice, I, like I'm supposed to roll five damage die to see how many on top of 10 I find. Oh, is that what that is? Yeah. So I think yeah. that's that's that like sense. I find ten plus roll five die. We did that for the end though in the beginning. If you remember, and that's yeah. Oh, all right. So I think Go I ahead and roll like it for me, Jaeger. Four damage. So it's I think I find fourteen bobby pins. Convenient word. Um, okay, so you're scavenging. Um, go ahead and give me that roll, Buck. Oh, sorry, I was muted. Uh, what's what's my role again? Sorry. Uh, uh, it 2D is... 20 perception and survival. Yes. Perception. Thank you. Perception. Survival. Jordan, can I roll that as well? Because I imagine my character kind of sees everyone else doing this. And it's kind of like, I don't really know why, but I kind of look around and see if there's anything like shiny or interesting. Yep. You right, can cool. definitely do that as well. All right. Buck's got two successes. You can go ahead and add one action point in there because this is a difficulty one. Um, so put that in the pool, David. Cool. Um, Nothing. But the, the robot sense. is like, ah, oh, fascinating. <laughs> <laughs> Handy doesn't see anything. Handy's looking around, doesn't find anything. I didn't uh, even look. I just asked Handy, like, Handy, do you see anything of interest? <laughs> and no, Handy doesn't. He just seems not to say anything. <laughs> yeah. Hey, uh, Doc, have you ever tried Commonwealth oysters? <laughs> <laughs> uh buck while you were while you're going through a um a cabinet you pick up a multi-tool um oh. that you think is going to be pretty useful for later on oh yeah um but honestly not much else it it, it it looks it looks like you know people have been to this station a lot in the last 200 years <laughs> you know cool okay I already have a multi-tool, so I just, in my mind, I just look at that. I was like, oh, I can sell this and make some, make a decent amount of caps, maybe. Okay. I, I imagine my character kind of, like, goes back into the hallway where everyone else is. Well, at least um, uh, Victor and Jaeger, and I kind of ask, like, does anyone need any medical assistance? Wait for a reply. They don't answer me, uh, which probably fits their character. Uh, and then my character uh, kind of is something like moves on. It's kind of moving around, trying to find the rest of the party and see. Cause I'm, a, I'm a medic, so I feel like that's what my character would do. Awesome. Uh, so, Jack, you're still up at the front right there. Yeah, I I take out a, a handkerchief I have and kind of like, you know, wipe down my gun. I'm a meticulous about that. Uh, and then Buck makes his uh, comment and I just kind of laugh and I said, well, you know, at least you could have helped a little bit on this, but, you know, I'll handle this one my own, I guess. Uh, and then I'm going to search as well, but I'm very much specifically looking for guns and ammo. Uh, hopefully 10 millimeter ammo, because I'm kind of <laughs> nice. going through that fast. Um, but I also noticed that Raider had that pipe pistol that he took a shot and hit me with. Uh, so, Or actually, no, he didn't hit me with that. The tire iron got me, but he shot at me. Yep. Um, and nothing. Yep. Where'd that pistol go? It just vanished. Yeah. Oh it exploded. God. My pistols break. That's true. They they did, I, I, that's, that's what I was going to say is it, it looks, it looks like it's, um, cause what do they call it? It's not reliable. Uh, there's a word for it. Um, as you're not investigating, <laughs> <laughs> that's two words, John, uh, as you're kind of looking down and investigating, you don't even realize that you hear this clapping coming uh, just kind of. Oh, shit. And old Cappy's ass just walks through the goddamn doors right there. And uh, he's just, uh, what do you call it? He's like, well done. Ah, seems like a little bit of reward is in order. And he's just kind of looking at, at Buck Casey and he's looking at uh, Jack. Uh, for you two, who are technically the only ones that see him right now, uh, going through your mind, I imagine, has got to be, how the hell did the 60-year-old walk all those Correct. miles? <laughs> it how doesn't matter. Hell? That's the magic of old Cappy. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> 
He's omnipotent. <laughs> yeah. Old Cappy always knows uh, what's going on. There's no way that this man should have made it here in time with the way that he walks. But, you know, there's some reason he's made it all the way to 60. So uh, where, where's the others at? I'm a, I, I actually shrug. I'm like, that's a damn good question. Uh, Buck, have you even seen them yet? Yeah, I seen them in the back somewhere. How, yeah. the, hell, how the hell did your old ass get here so dang fast? It took us a whole dang trip. We killed rad roaches. We did all this shit and you just stroll in. Yeah, Pilates. I've been doing a lot of Pilates. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. Uh, hey, Jordan. So I'm, yeah. I'll leave it up to you, but I imagine my character's been moving this whole time, kind of seeing the door and going into the door. So let me know whenever I enter that scene there. Um, where were you? Okay, David, you're all the way down there. Yeah, um, but I imagine my character would have been going around and kind of like heading towards the door, seeing that it's open, trying to find yeah. out the rest of my party. So you probably are getting in there as uh, you, you're fine to enter as Buck is kind of chiding old Cappy. Gotcha. I mean, if we've been if we've been salvaging and stuff, like I've probably wandered around and like you've seen us, right? Yeah, Victor, are you yeah, still eating that. body parts back there by yourself? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what I'm doing is cooking a delicious meal for all of us. Um, it's not quite Bobby Flay, if you remember those days. You would. Can you give us I one did. of those nutritional charts for what you're consuming right now? Boy, Bobby oh, Flay. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm making hey. a. Yeah, I'm going to, well, for one, I'm going to take the, you know, the big bits and I'm going to salt them and dry them out. We can make jerky, like jerk jerky, right? <laughs> and then, yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to have a snack right now. I don't know. I, okay. I have no idea what's going on out there. So I'm just. <laughs> okay. So uh, go ahead, David. Well, I was good. When I answer, I probably ask again if anyone requires any medical assistance because that's, that's my shtick. Okay. Uh, he's like, uh, no, I'm fine. <laughs> I just kind of glare at him. I'm still not trusting how he magically got here, but I, I kind of raise my hand. Uh, unfortunately, one of them got me uh, by surprise on the old forehead here. All right. <laughs> I get that buzz saw, starts whirling around, and I head towards him, and I'm ready to go. Ready to get some medicine. Uh, well, it, it's more of just like a contusion. I don't need anything. Uh, I bring up the plasma removed. gun, and I get that charge. <laughs> I'm ready to do a medicine check. Uh, <laughs> Cappy, uh, I know you put this team together. Is this actually what he's f- supposed to help with? Too late. Do a medicine <laughs> check. <laughs> Andy, hold him down. Uh, <laughs> he's, he's, a trained, he's a trained professional, damn it. <laughs> can, can I do, do you, a medicine check? I look, I, I look at you and I'm like, do you have an MD in puppetry? I don't think so. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, yeah. <laughs> All right. Medicine check. I really want you to crit fail so bad. It's not even funny. I just <laughs> saw, saw to just accidentally. Oh. Just, so all two successes. Like, okay. So I was looking, uh, Jordan. I was looking at this since he doesn't have any um, uh, injuries. The difficulty should be a zero because it says that it's equal well, to the difficulty. Have- I no, no, an injury is a crit. An injury is like a crit. Uh, oh, proc. okay. Okay. Yeah. I mean, so Jordan, would you, would you agree okay. with that assessment? Honestly, it doesn't matter. Even if you had one, because of my module, it reduces all my medicine checks by one anyway. Wow. That's awesome. Yeah, so yeah. it's. So You're damn you right, heal a number of it. <laughs> you heal, heal. Oh, hold on. There's a special section for healing robots. <laughs> my. Oh, no. That's about healing robots. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, I can't heal myself. So, <laughs> yeah. Uh, so he heals a number of HP equal to his rank in medicine skill, which, which is, is what? three. But also, there's more. Uh, but wait, there's more because I am a healer with my perk. You actually heal four points. Boom! Hell yeah! Damn. Okay. Well, I'm full up. Yeah, it is. Let's go, Doctor Mister Handy. <laughs> and the, like the buzz saw, I'm imagining like I see where he's scraping the buzz saw, like goes like right up to it, and like <laughs> I don't know. And then it's it's healed. It's stitched. I don't know how. Mr. Mr. Handy's in there, or, or Handy's in there, and he's like using his little puppet hands, and he's like doing little stitches or whatever, and it's all good to go. So I take notes on the session. This is just Dr. Mr. Handy flies a jack aggressively, or too aggressively heal him. That is uh, yeah. what is happening. Aggressively. Nice. Old Cappy's like, 
Well, four out of five of you isn't too bad, all right? You know what? Now we're trimmed down to a nice slim, because he doesn't see Victor. He's like, we're trimmed down to a nice slim team, and you guys got rid of Melty Face. I think that there's this moment, like, dramatically, <laughs> right, where the, the he, he comes walking through with, like, a handful of half-cooked meat, and he's chewing. Yeah. Who wants some breast? <laughs> uh, oh, Cappy's going to be like... <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm I'll good, pass. Victor. Thank you. I'm, I'm okay. Thank you. <laughs> he yeah. goes. He goes. I'm. I'm gonna pass. Um, so actually, uh, David had to step away for a second, but I think this is a good time to tell you guys because we can do this while he Ooh. is stepping away. XP. XP You're going XP. to get XP. That's Ooh. correct. Yeah. So you get seventy XP oh, shit. for oh. beating each of the raiders. That it puts us at the next level. At to level even. two. Yeah. yeah. That's Let's correct. Let's go. Bing. Kaboosh. Level two. Yeah, yep. that's awesome. Level Hell two. Yeah. So, what does that mean? <laughs> yeah, so I believe that you get a perk. I'm um, double checking. Character advancement is page 49. Perk. It's not it's as cool as it is in like Dungeons and Dragons. Um, level three is 300 XP. Um, that is required if anyone wants to be tracking that. Um, so your maximum health will increase by one. You choose one yeah. skill to increase by one rank up to a maximum of six, and then you gain a single perk. Oh, hell yeah. So. Awesome. What was the first thing you said? Maximum Your health. Your health goes up by one. Okay, max health. Or health. Yeah, that's just maximum HP. Is that what you're saying? Uh, yep. Sorry, what's that? So it, 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 when you do level two, it automatically did it for me. So just yeah. make sure you buy your HP up. Oh, oh, shit. Okay, let me put that back down. How much XP did we earn? God, I so love the guy you are now level two, David. You're at 100 XP total. Okay. So I, love I was just letting, characters. while you were taking care of the dog, I was letting them uh, start to level up the characters. Can, can we pick our perk between now and next session? Yeah, not a problem. That's okay. Uh, it just so, robs you the chance of using it this session, you know, the remainder. Yeah, I just don't. Okay, so don't we, get, we get one extra perk? Yeah, same. One yep, so, skill increase, one perk, one HP. But so, the HP is automatically done. When you okay, so we get to increase one skill, skill, but no skill can go past five, right? Six. Past six. six. Yep. Okay. And can we make a pact as players? Can we please make it something that we can justify that it increased because we used it? Because I hate it. I hate it when people are like, oh, I've been, I'm suddenly like a marksman. Can we do that? I will do that. Which I have just got better at lock yeah. pick. I was going to say, I'm doing lock. that. So. Do you mean like that just plays to your character? And be be thematic about why you yeah, got that. Like that you used okay. like, yeah, that makes no, sense. I, I increased my medicine skill because I just used it. There's that no cooking. I just, yeah. <laughs> I just critted this dude's head off. I think my melee went up. <laughs> Dude, I'm going to lock. I'm going to pick the shit out of every lock ever or cook all the corpses. So that goes to three. Fine. <laughs> okay, corpse cooking skill. Is that a three? Yeah, no. okay. house rules. It's fine. It's nice. Oh my gosh. And okay, cool. Point. Um, yep, so don't forget about the perk stuff. You guys can figure that out for next session if you want or while you're perusing. Um, but then continuing on. Oh, and so, uh, okay, actually, before I get into the rest of the story, I want to do time check for us, 9.20 right now. What is stop time that everyone wants to track tonight? Tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. I would love to have stopped because I'm on PTO and I missed you guys. So I'm going <laughs> oh until we're God. done. So you do you. Okay. Who's got, who's got the, the time, the time <laughs> stop that's, I mean, we're not going to go crazy, but I just want to make sure that I track it. I'm also PTO tomorrow. So I'm the wrong one to ask. You are. David. Let's go. Uh, Let's go. Is, is 11 too late, David? That's that's probably pushing too late. Uh, okay. I'd say for me, maybe like a 10 30, 10 30. I would be 10 30. It is all yeah. right, cool. Sorry to be the party pooper there. Can we no, just I was okay. gonna say 10 no. too. Do we want to <laughs> take like a five? So, mm -hmm. you need, do you need a poopsie? Well, I don't, but see, there's <laughs> this thing, there's this thing in the box over here that's like, <laughs> and it's not a person, it's it's not a gimp or anything. Let weird. the box it's panther like, out, that's fine. Uh, box panther, all right. I'm gonna go pee. Yeah, I'm gonna get a refill. We'll too. be back in less than 10 minutes, everyone. Go pee, Thorg. <gasps> Go pee, Thorg. Good time to look no, at your perks, possibly. No, no, really, Thorg. Go pee. We're, we're serious. We want you to... We're watching. Yeah. Let's watch. Shall we? <laughs> hey, Joran, do you know what page uh, the perks are on? Yeah, they are on page 40... No, 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 no. I lied to you. Hold on. Uh, 59. 59. 59. I was almost there. 
I should really, I love my physical book. I should stop using it though, because it's so much slower for me to find things. Yeah. Man, I don't know. The, the PDF takes forever to load anything. It's really frustrating. I don't Is know if it's a, um, the same for you guys, but like when I try to control F and like search for phrases and terms, it doesn't pull those back quickly at is, all. is there a page about leveling up i also make sure that i don't i don't miss anything um i don't i don't know. have that on hand i just noted what he said which was one hp one skill i just realized as well that jason didn't actually pause the stream so everyone <laughs> can hear the body break <laughs> all right that's fine chat i hope you're going to the bathroom we're looking at perks we're looking at things i'm peeing i should pee why am i not peeing Perk, are you taking? I'm still trying to figure that out. I think I need to take more time about it, but same. I'm looking forward to using. I have this gun food perk that essentially lets me attack multiple enemies, like if they're in a room and I succeed on one. But it hasn't just. It just hasn't happened yet. I don't know. Yeah, I, I can't take that until I increase agility by one. I should have yeah. thought about I that did, longer term. Well, I did. I tried to do all of this point reworking, and both of you and I did that. Um, what's that called? Gifted child, or we we did. Yeah, yeah. We did that whole thing to reduce our luck to get more stuff, and I did it so I could get that perk. Um, which is it's an awesome perk. Um, but yeah, I just haven't ran into it yet. But everything else for my type of character doesn't. I don't know. I have to like really kind of think about what it makes what makes sense for my character. She's mainly more small guns focused. Um, I don't know if we'll get into anything yet, but you know I do have abilities around like being able to fly a vehicle. Um, when you level up, I thought it was um, how do you increase your special? Because I thought it was like you could take a perk or increase your special. But I'm trying to find it in the rules where it says that we got one skill. Right? Is that for a special or is that just for a the regular that's, skills that's, that's just normal skills like know. like medicine repair science but yeah david's but, right we usually a special would increase all right well i, I it might be like D D where it only increases certain levels or something like that but I'm, no and there, no there's no like level chart it's basically after level one you get one extra hit point one perk and one skill yeah that's but all it says. Just stays the same forever interesting <sighs> i thought i read somewhere that you could instead of taking um special i'll be right back um mm, yeah i'll be right back this is a weird question of i asked jordan are we going to be mainly fighting men or women <laughs> <laughs> say hi oh to adorable say hi to this this people man yeah he is going to be he's going to be fucking big. huge he's ridiculous <laughs> So, uh, within a day, so I picked him up yesterday, he, he will not tolerate being like five feet away from me. He goes ape shit. And, uh, that's not all. Stop biting me. But when, but when he's with me, he bites me. Um, and, uh, he, he's, I don't know. Long story. But he's that's just, awesome. He's man. a cool dude. So this What's is, his name? His Archer. Archer. Very After cool. the cartoon, which. Very nice. <laughs> Stop fucking with my microphone, bro. You gotta go back in the box and you can have a... <laughs> yeah. Can I have a familiar? Is that a thing? Jordan. I'll allow it. I want, it, it he would be slightly cooler than the German Shepherd. <laughs> oh my God. It, oh, he fucked the mic up. I know. He did. <laughs> I gotta replace that. The, that dog is goddamn adorable. He's big. 
That that was what we wanted though, Jason. We wanted large. Actually, you can take the perk dog meat. You have a pet dog. <laughs> I did think about that even for myself, the taking dog meat. It's pretty cool, but like how does how does RP work for that? You know, like are you kind of like simulating his what he would do and then like <laughs> you have to bark. Well, it's, it's a minor action right to command <laughs> you so to, don't you have to take a minor action no, to tell you, you, have to bark. Bark. you gotta bark <laughs> you have to bark and, yep. so jordan we were trying to figure out i thought there was a way where when you were leveling up that you could increase your special i thought it was like you could take a perk or a special but i can't find the, anything the, there is a perk to increase a special oh so it's a, it's a perk oh. to increase okay okay thank that's you. what that's what john has He's looking God, like he or my, or Michael, stuff. maybe. No, it's a. It's not a perk though. It's a background that increases the special. Mm -hmm. Oh, well. yes, he's right. But there's probably a perk too, though, right? Yeah, there definitely could be. I'm looking. There's a ton of perks. <laughs> That's the other thing. Like, I gotta take some time because there's a lot of perks. Yeah, I need to find the ones that it would be like interesting and rank them. Yeah. Yeah, that's actually a good idea. I'll probably like note a whole bunch of them so that way next time we do this, like I kind of know which ones thought it was make sense like to my character. Education, but maybe I'm getting that confused. You're probably not wrong. No, it's not education. You're wrong. Uh Jordan. John, Did you say most enemies are going to be male or female. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I've plotted out all 10 sessions and I'm thinking most of them at least identify as men. Okay, okay, okay. Just wonder, just an Oculus question. That's all. So. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah. I Next had a girl session, dump me. like a group of like lady fighters that are all just like ready Amazon. <laughs> I had a girl dump me in high school that broke my heart, so it's all females from here on out. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Take that. <laughs> Whatever your name is. Whatever your <laughs> whichever ex girlfriend I'm aiming this at. That that probably is not watching this anyway, so I can <laughs> <laughs> Yep. Exactly. So Bro. Uh, I am going to ask clarification on this perk because in I'm used to the video games. It's Black Widow slash Lady Killer. Usually if you are a man in the Fallout guys, you can get Lady Killer, which means you can do more damage to women and persuade them and stuff like that. In this one, it'll it, from what it's reading, it sounds like you can just choose whichever one. I'm just wanting to verify. I mean, it's that, the 21st. I was like cheating. It's the twenty third something. It's the twenty third century. century. <laughs> By the twenty third century, I'm identifying as an octopus. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Have you watched uh, season three of The Boys yet? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> this, this, Why? Don't. Oh my god. <laughs> no. Yeah, I, I just didn't. got. I just got what you meant. Yeah. That's. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. So so with with I Wild Dawn. Finished it yet. After season two, so with Wild Dawn, I'm like, yeah, let's let's do something that's like the boys, but more depraved. And then I saw the first episode of season three, yeah. <laughs> and I was Holy like, hell, yeah. yeah, I was like, man, I'm not nearly gross enough. <laughs> yeah, you're like, you're not. No, yeah. that's on another level, man. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah. It's so good. What is? Let me figure this out. Piercing. This piercing. Wait, wait, what? <laughs> Get. You're gonna get I'm talking about piercing. Are you talking go get piercings and <laughs> yeah. roll for your piercing location, John? Mm. Roll for piercing. Yeah, you got to think you get lady killer, guys. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> you got it in the number two. What's the number two? I don't know. I see what you did there. I see what you did there. Stop staring at me. Okay, are we all good? I think some of us are gonna think through perks later on. Yeah, I'm um, gonna do perks later on. I'm gonna I'm gonna, yeah. gonna move some story Jordan, forward. It's intense yeah. training. Is it, oh okay. There we go. I knew there was. But you one. can't do it. You can't do it every turn, uh, every level. It says each time you take this perk, the level requirement increases by two. Mm. So if you do it on level two, you can't do it again to level four. Interesting. 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 Mm, quite. <laughs> but you can't. It is one of those that has like ten ranks, so you can use it a lot eventually over the if, life of the uh, campaign. 
Yeah. If, if you, if you worked it right though, cause max level is 20, right? You'd have to be very specific about, uh, taking it. I, I think it's, level. I think it's technically like max level is 20, but like, yeah, yeah I mean, it, it, you kind of go past it. That's true. Sorry. What it, was that again? I can, you can increase special max it, level is 20. By, you can, oh, not my yeah. faces. So you can take the perk intense training. There's 10 ranks to it. So you can take it 10 times. Um, each time you take it, you can increase any one special attribute attribute by one rank. However, when you take that, you can't take mm. it again until two levels past where Got you it. took it. Right. So if you took it now, you Thank couldn't you. do it again to level four. Yep. Cool. But good call out because that is what I'll be taking. Jason, quick question for the crowd. Is this your first night with the, with the Panther? Uh, with the dog? Yeah, no. So yeah. last night, he came home last night, and I slept on, okay. on the floor next to his crate because he was going ape shit. And, uh, That's what I was going to say is the first night with a new dog is always something oh, magical. Yeah. It's and just and like, he, yeah. how do you figure it he, out? He literally gets spastic if he's more than like five feet away from me, which yeah. is really cool. Like, because, yeah. you know, like, and when I went to pick him up, long story short, but uh, I visited him a couple times as he was growing to eight weeks. And yeah. uh, I went to pick him up, and he was, he, I think it was the smell, probably, because I don't bathe yeah. much. I don't know that you know the smell. <laughs> right. But he was just so excited. I don't say anything normally. Yeah, so he's yeah. just like, I don't know, it's fine. I don't give a shit. I just wiped down with a Stridex pad where it matters. And But, <laughs> he, he, but he was so excited. He was, and, and then the whole ride home. He slept. Awkward. He's heavy. He's like twenty pounds. He's eight weeks and twenty. Oh, days. he's gonna be <coughs> a fucking dog. Yeah. A big boy. And uh, yeah, but he li he likes to listen to music. If I want to, it's like my kid. She had colic, so I like play some like sedate emo. He likes emo. Um, yeah, no judging. <laughs> I, no judging. He likes chill emo, and he likes to drive. So I'm just like, where can I go? And let's play some chill fucking emo with twenty pounds. And I'm like about to wreck into people, but whatever. Yeah, so glad I took nice. this week off. That's awesome. Oh, you have a week off? Oh, I, yeah. Well, <clears throat> three days. At least the rest of the week, right? Yeah, three days. Yeah, it took three whole days. Huh. Yeah. Well, Listen, Jason technically works a week inside of three days, so that's probably yeah. accurate still. No, I, I, yeah, I, yeah, fuck it. Okay, <laughs> so... <laughs> uh, <Moving on. laughs> that's, that's, that's the perfect opportunity to break out the alcohol. Oh. Yeah. Uh, all right, moving on with some story. Stop scaring me. Um, <laughs> the dog is judging you. He's the judging dog is actually straight edge like I am, so we're both just like looking at you, just like what is happening? Uh, where was I? Where was I? Where was I? Okay, we got some XP. Uh, I lost my place in my notes. Sorry. Uh, cool, 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 cool. Okay. Uh, well, now that we're all accounted for. Seems like a little bit of a reward is in order. And he takes out this pouch from uh, under his clothes and he starts slowly counting caps individually into his hands. Um, and eventually, over the course apiece? of. Uh huh. <laughs> That's awesome. No. Uh, <laughs> he, sorry, sorry. I'm going to clarify. Uh, but he, he hands. Yeah, it is. Okay, sorry. I miss it. He hands each of you 50 caps out of a questionable smelling sack and just individually is counting them to you like your grandmother giving you your allowance. Story One, of my life. Two. <laughs> and just doing like that long, like, eh, like and putting is he, is he licking his thumb between? Oh, definitely. <laughs> Before uh, I get mine, can I say... You know what? Maybe I can save you some time. Do you happen to have any extra ammunition on you that I can purchase so you don't need to give me all 50? Do I look like a carrying care, uh, <laughs> a, a traveling carrot? Do, what do I look like to you? <laughs> um, Nailed it. Not you look like that someone so, who doesn't. Yeah, do thank you? you for the caps. I appreciate it. You look uh, like you don't have the benefit of time, but you're going to take a lot of it counting out all these caps. You may die yeah. before we get our reward. You got to put your spit on every single <laughs> cap. God damn. You're welcome. Sometimes <laughs> I make people pay extra for that. That's gross. What's the equivalent <sighs> of OnlyFans in like the Fallout time? Oh, my God. <laughs> only, only Fallout? I don't know. 
Uh, and that means that, 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 that <laughs> you know what? Never mind. I'm not, I'm going to stop. No, nope, I'm Just going fans. there. All right. Anyway, look, the, what people are paying extra for instead of feet pictures is just like weird <laughs> wasteland fallout. <laughs> Third eyes, maybe. Mm. Oh, yeah. Definitely Victor would be on only fallout, sending pictures of his weird eye. <laughs> That's right. I like when the eye goes around like this. Uh, somebody paid me 50 caps to eat a bug in front of them. You want to, you want to see everything I can do with the rad roach? <laughs> Exactly. Mm. Uh, so wait, oh so wait. Okay. <laughs> Too far. Are we assuming they have like internet, or is this delivered on like VHS? <laughs> oh, no, it's in person. <laughs> yeah, it's in person. It's actually a peer-to-peer Pip Boy network. Okay. <laughs> 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 so you're picking up other content off of nearby, Pip like Boys. over a radio oh. signal. Oh, I am definitely pirating only Fallout. <laughs> yeah, P two P. Pit boy to pit boy. Is that available? <laughs> oh my god! I don't know. Please go. Uh, <laughs> Save oh, us, Jordan. Start this website uh, only Fallout. You know, I, I could I could literally spend an entire session talking about only Fallout. The, the session that we do the puppetry is going to be the session we do only Fallout. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Okay, so uh, Cappy's like. Looks like I picked the right group of folks to uh, get the job done. Um, marvelous, marvelous, I say. And so he's obviously excited. And he's like, all right, all right, all right. I said that I would tell you the rest of it. Now, find something comfortable or le- at least not pokey to lean against. And I think it's time I tell you about the real mission. So I'm assuming you guys are all just finding kind of seats or something comfortable to lean against. Maybe break out another piece of meat to eat, Victor. Because yeah, sounds no, like no, I, I, I think I try story. to hand my my newfound companions like a little stick of questionable <laughs> meat from something. Yeah, you know? here's, uh, a, here's, here's, a, here's a toe. Yeah, come on. When he says the real mission, handy like whoosh, like gets really excited, and, like turns and stares right at him. Like I want to, bo- I want to bond with Handy, but like I got nothing for him. I'm like, well, shit, you won't appreciate. Do you have, do you have any wing meat? I don't know. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I give him an ear. <laughs> yeah, that's probably- he, he probably has thigh meat. If you're after some thigh meat, <laughs> I was thinking some thighs or like some bicep. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, probably. I'll uh, try it. As you guys are getting down and choosing whether to partake in the uh, in the uh, <laughs> in, in our friend the raider. Um, now, I'm sure that you guys are syrup suckers like myself, you know, old Nuka Cola lovers. Anyhow, uh, I have it on good authority from our employer that there are two valuable pieces of treasure buried in a secret location inside of Nuka World. You know, that old abandoned theme park they built to celebrate soda? Uh, both of them seem contained inside of a vault. Well, not a literal vault tech vault. Well, at least I don't think so. I, who knows? I digress. Anyway, one of the pieces of treasure is the long desired but hidden formula. And he's like getting all squinty. I was like, the long desired uh, but uh, hidden formula for Nuka Cola. As he says employed- that, Jordan, my one yep. functional eye is getting bigger yep. with him. The other one's yep. just staring off all glassy and weird. But it's just like, <laughs> oh, shit. Because, yeah, I was I was around then. So I'm like. <gasps> yep. Just the one. The, <laughs> yep. Just the, the just the one that they're paying yep. for pictures for on Only Fallout. Uh, <laughs> uh, Sir Jack uh, is going to take a picture on his pit boy just in case he wants to sell it later of the weird eye. Uh, <laughs> one of the pieces of treasure is the long desired but hidden formula for Nuka Cola which our employer is willing to pay handsomely for. Well, the other is a giant supply of caps uh, that were just eagerly awaiting bottles to be put on top of. I mean, who knew that uh, those would be currency one day? And that's our payout, the vault of unused caps. We'll be rich, boys. And and he looks at uh, Dr. Mr. Handy and Dr. Robot Ma'am, of course, and he like bows because <laughs> uh, he still thinks you're a female. Uh, I'm just asking for a sliver of a 10% cut on your findings for arranging this whole endeavor for everyone. You know, your wildest dreams to come true and all. Is there any chance that there's going to be cola there? Because my God, I love that shit. I sure hope so. Mm. So, old Cappy, let me get this straight. 
the client that understandably you won't tell us about has come to learn this information. You've assembled this uh, eclectic team uh, to go and claim this recipe, yet this underground vault of caps is ours for the taking, minus a 10% fee. Well, you can't just rush into Nuka World uninformed, okay? It's a place of raiders, after all, Jack. I thought you would have known that. So I've been having someone gather some intel on the inside about what the situation is like. So uh, it's not exactly a walk in the park, I would say. There's uh, there's a, about three different groups of raiders that kind of run the situation. So it's not going to be easy. What are you going to do to earn your 10% cappy? He's going to throw you back this eyeball. He's going to be like, I'm going to spare your life, bug sucker. <laughs> Is that what he says? Yeah. He's just like annoyed that like he's arranged this whole thing for you and you're now questioning his value. <laughs> okay. Okay. Understood. Mental note, uh, task list, kill Cappy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Cappy must die. So I'm going to try to... Oh, maybe. Oh, shoot. I was going to try to do speech um, and just try to get him to tell us any additional information that I I guess there's an insight. Try to get a gauge of if he's telling us the whole truth and everything like that. So um, about this, sure. uh, these three groups, um, can you elaborate there? And do you have any more tangible information whether it's patrol patterns or a map or anything of the sort. Well, I'm glad you asked that, Jack. You see, um, I and that um, I'll charge you. Yeah, one one is fine actually. Um, well, as I was as I was beginning to say, I've been gathering intel, and the gentleman, uh, his name is Merle, uh, that was getting ready to tell me about the situation on the inside. Problem is the the raiders got to him before he can make it back to safety. Uh, I, I wouldn't advise us going forward without what he knows because he's got some of the information that you seek. Um, now, after this whole encounter, I'm sure you guys could use a good night's sleep. But I've got a plan in the morning. I'm going to discuss on how to get him back. And, and at this point, you guys are starting to realize that like night has fallen. Um, you're probably feeling a, a bit fatigued. Uh, about what's going on there and it's kind of like oh yeah like I've, especially those that were partaking in the meal it's you're getting that sense of like oh i'm digesting i'm getting a little sleepy it's like, like thanksgiving except you're eating a raider instead of turkey <laughs> yep exactly and so, 200 year old mayonnaise but so all, <laughs> uh, all of that will be covered in in the morning on how we get him back that's step number one jack Mm. I feel yeah. like me being a, a medical robot, uh, I'm kind of like looking at Cappy. Can I do like any check to see if there's anything like medically weird about this guy? Maybe even not like like unusual, but just, you know, he's old. So can I like advise him on maybe uh, how he needs to improve his his health to uh, live longer? You know, like maybe his blood sugar is a little bit low or something <laughs> or, you know, he needs to work on his. I'll allow it. All right. I'll allow it. What am I doing? You um, would allow it. <laughs> diffi difficulty zero. <laughs> Let's see. Do you I'm have just, like I'm a pro do you have like a prostate exam attachment or some weird shit? <laughs> I feel like, like handy could do that. Handy. <laughs> As a medicine check. Do it. Yeah, int uh, int medicine. All right, I, I got I got three successes here, man. I know everything about this guy. Um, <laughs> What's his deal? I turn What's away from the scene. I'm level? like, I can't bear to watch the exam. I'm like, Whoa. give give me the results of my last three checkups. Uh, all right. So I'm. I, am I? Because I mean, I. All right. I mean, I feel like you're in failing health here, old Cappy. You need to be exercising a lot more. I've seen uh, that your your blood uh, your blood pressure is is elevated. Uh, your um, let's see, your uh, man, I don't know. Your 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 bilirubin level is a little bit high. 
Mm. Uh, it, his core strength is good from Pilates, though, I assume. I was about to say, true. his movement is actually true. pretty good. So, he got across the wasteland like in two times speed than we did. But he should not have. <laughs> Is what I'm thinking. Ah, uh, okay. You need to All eat right. more vegetables, right? Which I know is hard for, you know, this environment, but definitely less radiation, more vegetables. <laughs> uh, less, watch your salt no, intake. That's the episode name. Less radiation, more vegetables. I'm writing. That's it. That's it. That's <laughs> fucking brilliant. That's pretty good. Cholesterol is a little bit high, but overall, I get, you know, you're getting old. You're getting old. <laughs> that, that's my professional diagnosis. You're getting old, old Cappy. <laughs> Well, nobody asked you for that, but okay, you're right. <laughs> uh, thank you, Dr. Mr. Handy. Maybe stick to the puppetry. I'm clearly fine. Uh, and he's just like dismissive of you. He's like, whatever. I don't like, because he's that old grandpa, like, I don't not need no doctor, folks. Like, get off of me. I'm going to die high on chems. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, old Cappy's like, I think you should find some corner to sleep in and uh, get some shut eye. We'll I'll have something whipped up in the morning for us before we start our, our next big adventure. Cappy looks at Buck, or sorry, Buck looks at Cappy and goes, you know, Cappy, we're going to need some, if we're going to do this thing, we're going to need some real ammunition. We're going to need some, we're going to need some real firepower if we're going to take anything out. You got something for us or do we got to go somewhere? How are we going to handle that, Cappy? Well, I've got some uh, I've got some options laid out tomorrow as part of the plan, which I'll cover um, that one of the options is um, going to lend you some ammo. One of the options mm, spend you some ammo. So I'll let you guys decide in the morning. Stop keeping me up, Buck. You know, I need my shut eye. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? What he said is we need bullets. Do you have bullets or not? And uh Oh, Cappy is like showing under his shirt and stuff like that. He's just like, do I look like I have bullets? Does he have bullets under his shirt and weird shit or no? No, no, he doesn't. He just, he just has really frail looking bones. Let me ask. Going you. on. Does he have an Audi? Uh, no, he's an innie. Okay, he's got good. an innie. Right, good, good. Uh, Milk dud nipples, though. <laughs> oh. Uh, <laughs> yeah. like Very hairy. Sagging fingers. <laughs> My point uh, is, Buck is the... He's right. We need ammo. We went in there with machetes and tire irons and three bullets. If you're going to ask us to take over the world, we're going to need some ammo. Cappy. Well, good thing I gave you money to go find some. <laughs> oh, let me just take a minute and go to Ammo Mart down the road. <gasps> it got blown the <laughs> fuck up in 20. <laughs> Can you help us with the ammo? Cappy, can, uh, can you? Oh, Cappy's gonna kind of get in Victor's face and be like, I thought you were a professional, Victor. <laughs> I'm a professional and he's literally survivor. Like, <laughs> like, he's like, kind of like Stone Cold Steve Austin-ing you, like... I'm a professional... I do, I'm a professional survivor, which is exactly what yeah. I did. I went in the back door, like I always do. We need bullets. Oh, Cappy? Help us. Uh, what, Please. What kind of, what kind of bullets... What kind of bullets do you need, Victor? <laughs> he, he just like shits out a whole bunch of bullets on you. Oh my god! What? No, but like, what? What are you armed with right now? You asking an old bit, old Victor? Or sorry, yeah, you asking Victor? Vic yeah, I'm asking Victor. What kind of what kind of weapon do you have, Victor? Like uh, a it, range weapon? Uh, I mean, he's got a no. That doesn't. Even, he's got a machete, a baseball bat. He, yeah, Victor, Victor's kind of just no. no so, he 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 why no, 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 is, no, no, but he has a no, no. Hang on, hang on. He doesn't. Half of the group. He has a hunting <laughs> rifle. He has a hunting rifle, but he's yeah, like taking a single shot. No, no. Yeah, he's there, scrappy in front of uh, based on the, the Bucks thing because Bucks the you know the murder man yeah. as far as he knows, yeah. like not realizing that honestly Jack was the guy who basically was all up in the business. But yeah, he's don't need to know that. But Buck, how what is what do you have? What is your uh, ammo? 44, 44. 44 revolver. Yeah. He gives you one bullet. <laughs> <laughs> uh no, so this is what happens. He like yeah. oh Cappy is just like annoyed that you're kind of like giving him some shit and he like put turns his back to you and then turns around and goes, "I got two bullets for you right here." And then he grabs his crotch, but then actually Puts his hand down his pants and pulls out two bullets. Oh, no. and chucks them I, I literally, I literally, I think as he as he pulls these, I think I step aside and let him hit 
bug Casey in the chest, I'm like, that's gross. <laughs> that's gross. Yeah, I mean, yeah. they yeah. just if they if you if you throw them and they hit my chest, I just look at. It. I'm not I'm not using that ammunition. <laughs> they're both they're both bullets. You got to. <laughs> nah, I, I'm good. Uh, I'll I find my own ammo. <laughs> no, you know what? I, I will pick them. I'll pick them up. I'll pick them up. Oh, and I think I'm just thinking up. to myself like. I look at Buck and I'm like, when you run out of ammo, I got you. I got you. Uh, and I, yeah. <laughs> Go ahead and add two ammo to your inventory. 244, like right? like stuff please, down his pants. Please specify them as ball bullets. <laughs> yeah. I'm looking but, for... A I'm looking forward to like session 25 where like I need these dang bullets and he pulls them out. And that. I hope he does the same move where he just grabs them. No, and pulls no them what I'm going to do, uh, Mr. Handy, to your question, I'm going to pull them out of my apocalypse pocket. That's what I'm going to do. Oh my pocket. God. So two forty-four rounds. Yeah. Yeah. That's embarrassing. That, hope I you never know, use them. There are better ways to get bullets in this video game. <laughs> yeah. The man is a senior citizen. You shouldn't have accosted him. Okay. You're right. I give up. <laughs> Click out okay. to get started. So old Cappy is kind of walking into a um, into a corner, and he's obviously clearly shutting his eyes. He doesn't even care if the rest of you are trying to sleep at this point. <laughs> he's just kind of just like, I said I'm going to bed now. I need my shut eye. Because a balanced night's sleep is how he's made it to 60 in the wasteland. So, um, before kind of darkness fall, I mean, darkness has already fallen, but before we kind of close the scene, any, any sort of stuff people are doing before bed that we want to account for the stream. Uh, Dr. I Mr. Handy, I, had, I was just going to say, I assume that you don't, are you kind of like in sleep mode or like, yeah, what, no, what they do don't have a, as far as I can tell, they don't have a sleep mode. I feel like I, I probably just kind of chill but I think I'm just like constantly aware. Like I would be like the perfect lookout. I was going to say, I'm assuming you would maybe be monitoring the entrances and exits. Yeah. I don't, I don't sleep. I don't eat. I am the perfect machine. <clears throat> so when we're talking about salvaging common and uncommon materials, which are just kind of lumped into like these categories, do you need a workbench to do that? Or can you just like hack up a table to get common materials like wood and shit? Because, like, if he could be spending the night just, like, breaking shit and, you know, <laughs> acquiring materials, that would be awesome. That's a good question. Um, I would guess that theoretically he could, but let me see here. Because I think it's, like, 10 minutes to salvage, like, a small item or something like that to get, like, common and uncommon, potentially. Yeah. So, we'll say, we'll say this, David. I could let you spend the time from now until the morning doing some of that if you want. Um, but you'll have to specify how much and I'll consider that time not spent guarding the entrances. Uh, so far, no one has asked my character to do that and my character would have no thought probably to do that in the first place. If anything, my character would be like reciting some Shakespeare or some shit in his head <laughs> and like acting yeah. out like a play. No, yeah, if, 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 if we if all that's just allowed. fall asleep instantly. Yo, ha Handy, you think you could chop up some tables and stuff and get us some, some wood and materials for... Happy uh, to assist, sir! Some Molotovs? <laughs> Excellent. So um, I was actually going to say, sorry to interrupt, but like during this, um, Buck kind of waits until like it's kind of quieted down, and then he kind of... And then what do you hear? A... <laughs> <laughs> I was just gonna say, you're having me like use my buzz saw to like chop up furniture while you guys are trying to sleep. That's kind of fair. <laughs> oh, Cappy is so pissed. <laughs> I need a full six hours. Uh, I mean, uh, I'll, d I'll, I'll do it because I don't need to sleep. But is that realistic that I'd be like literally breaking down furniture and shit while y'all are sleeping? Well, you just close yourself off in the like the back rooms. <laughs> Oh, old Cappy is going to wake up so mad. We literally have nowhere to sit in our hideout. I don't think the robot's going to give a shit. <laughs> I suggest that might draw attention to like uh buzzsaw might carry in, you know, that's fair. Silent that's fair. night. Yeah. Okay. Scavenging we'll tonight. tonight and then figure out scavenging futures. So Buck, okay. Buck does try to find uh doc while he's kind of whatever he's doing. Um, <laughs> and it's just like a hey, doc. Got a little bit hurt from these uh, rad roaches earlier. You think he can uh, patch me up? And he's kind of like embarrassed, right? He doesn't want everybody to know um, that he got hurt from the rad roaches, but uh, he's looking for some uh, quick heals while everybody's kind of asleep and not paying attention. 
I mean, I'm constantly awake. Can I do some sort of like perception check to see if I overhear that? Yeah, I mean, well, that talk- conversation. He's talking, he's talking to Yeah, he's I'm talking, talking to, you. to you. Yeah, he's talking to you. <clears throat> oh, I thought you were talking to old Cabin for some reason. No, no, I'm talking. I'm, I'm asking you while everybody's like kind oh, of yeah, asleep, yeah, yeah. and I, I'm trying to be discreet. But I want I go, you to. Do you like- got anything for my injuries <laughs> tucked <laughs> under there? I mean, I, I heard him say that he didn't want anyone else to know. So I figured he was asking like old Cabby for some like I don't know. No, uh, I'm asking you, trying to keep it quiet to everybody yeah. else. And I go. Absolutely. Uh, you know, uh, patient uh, was doctor patient privilege is, is uh, absolutely critical in my field. Uh, you know, mum's the word. And uh, I perform a, uh, a medicine check. Uh, I rolled a vasectomy. I perform a vasectomy and colonoscopy at the same so, okay. time. I would like to point out here I know I got a complication here, but I also got two successes. And the difficulty would have been like a negative one because he had zero injuries, and I've got a uh, I have a a, a menis, uh, what is it a um uh, a diagnosis module. So Jordan, if you wouldn't mind just taking that into consideration, <laughs> you're going your in the wrong your way. Uh, Jeez, I, dude. I, I regret this. I regret all this. <laughs> the buzzsaw just accidentally lops everything off. From the front. I feel like would be more appropriate would be more like I wake up everyone and they know that I was like, you know, healing yeah. fuck. I rolled Get a your buzzsaw out of his rectum. What all right, you Jordan, what's the complication? Yeah. The complication is that you don't smell the smoke that is coming from the back because... Nobody put out the fucking fire well, on the table. <laughs> oh, you if mean you, the back? Jordan, I thought you, you meant the all... back of Buck. I was like, that's not cool at all. <laughs> <laughs> not about that. Not no, about no. that. Hey, so, Jordan, wow. if you want, totally, that's that's what we can do. However, I just want to remind you that as a robot, I have really good senses for detecting smells, chemicals, and radiations, and it's supposed to reduce my my check on that by one, a difficulty of one. If you still want that to happen, absolutely. But if you crit- I just want to remind you. Yeah, I'm going to say that that module that allows that has definitely malfunctioned uh, sure. because you should have detected it. And you're probably going to realize when you do your own diagnosis, diagnostic tests tonight that, hey, that module <laughs> needs to be repaired. Um, but okay. Victor brought his snacks up with the fire that was still roasting on there, kind of went and joined <laughs> everyone. And it's been cooking. And now uh, the back is on fire. <laughs> Uh, Buck, you are, however, healed by five. Okay. You're very welcome. Okay, uh, cool. Thank with my perception much. above, did I notice that he was healing Buck? Dude, I, I had one you, success. Why are you trying to? Why are you trying to get this perception? Are you asleep? <laughs> yeah. He wants uh, to be very you know focused. He really wants I'll to know. I'll allow it. No, no, no. I'm not. I'm not making any comments. <laughs> we'll save okay. that one. Back Hold pocket. On. Roll perception, <laughs> dickhead. <it>. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. Do you really want to check, John? Oh yeah, no, I rolled it above already. He rolled it like as soon as I as soon as I said it, he rolled it he like is immediately. Focused on, yeah, every orifice no, of I'm, not, I'm not allowing like, I'm not allowing that. That would have been more than one oh, difficulty. Damn. Okay. No. Uh anyway. <laughs> Sorry, Jordan. Flames. Buildings on fire. Anyway, flames. <sighs> Old Cappy's going to start to wake up. What the hell? <laughs> Can you draw more flames on all of the tiles? Yeah, I, I literally will. <laughs> so, I, will. I mean, I Wait, jump we were, up because we, I didn't know there was a fire. We were all sleeping uh, out like front, right? Yeah, that's what I'm yeah, assuming front, is that we're all yeah. sleeping in the okay. front. Um, and it is now basically what's happened is that the flames have kind of reached um, the wrong like, color. Here. Uh, and I'm using the wrong thing here. Yeah, so the... Oh, damn it. Why is it still green? Red. <laughs> the flames have started to reach this area, right? So now it's getting noticeable that, like, stuff is on fire. This is... I mean, here, Victor, move yourself so that I don't mark you on fire. I do what I want. Where am I? That's true. I'm sorry. Yeah, can move I, yourself. Can I now do a, uh, a check with my heightened smell to see if now that I'm not healing <sighs> Buck, if I... Uh, where, where's I everybody know there's smell a fire. that smoke? <laughs> Oh, we all know there's a fire now? All right. Yeah, yeah there you go. Where, where is everybody else check? hanging out? <laughs> yeah, so Every, the rest of us are kind of in the front. Yeah, I was asleep kind of on the counter. Area. Yeah. 
Okay. This is all fire. Yeah, I was behind the counter, and I think I'm the only one that didn't know there was a fire, period. Um, so I jumped to my feet with uh, and pulled my gun immediately and said, they're trying to smoke us out. Who? What the fuck are you talking about? It's just like alarmed. You're suddenly... I, I'm just like pointing at the fire. I don't know the writers. <laughs> oh, oh, oh is like, did you not secure the perimeter? <laughs> I, I I was... So, uh, I, I go to the door. Wait, because I have to walk all the way around the building to see that. No, I'm not. I'm, no, I'm, uh, no, I mean, I'm you would be able to see. Go ahead. Are we inside or outside? I thought people were saying we were outside kind of chilling and some people were resting. Or are we inside? We're inside. We're sleeping. Inside. sleeping. We were inside sleeping. Okay. I thought someone said we were outside out front. So no, is, is, has the, is it, it's, it's enough on fire that it's actually smoky throughout the whole place, right? Like yeah. we're coughing yeah. half blind, like yeah. running out the fuck <laughs> this, I'm just running out the front door. Shit. I, I'd be like, you I'm know the, the last bits I left on slow and low, you know, it's tender that way. I I forgot, I'm sorry. I I shit. Was this uh, dang barbecue from before? Um uh, Oh Cappy's gonna exit the building just know. cough it. <laughs> <laughs> I probably say uh, something like, "Everyone, please exit stage right." <laughs> it's uh, old Cappy's gonna look at you, at, uh, Doctor Mister Handy, and be like, "Can you put that out or something?" The one who doesn't have any lungs, <laughs> like the rest of us have <laughs> lungs. Uh, I mentioned that I, I like. Uh, uh, let's see. Um, <laughs> He's like, like I have it. to. I have to watch out for the safety of Handy. He's made of oh, like no! very flammable polyester. <laughs> thing burn because you don't want Handy to hit Crispy? I mean, I'm also not immune to fire. I'm immune to radiation <laughs> and, like, poison and stuff. But, I mean, why would I put out a fire in a building that is unoccupied? We all left the building. We're in the building, you fuckface! <laughs> <laughs> Some people have run out the building here. I, I feel like, I feel okay. like, <laughs> as a medical doctor, that I'll be more interested in making sure people vacate the building versus trying to put nice. out a fire nice. in a gas station. Nice. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, so, oh, shit. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm hoping I mean, the gas, gas evaporates is... pretty quickly. I mean, there's it's been no 200 gas, years. 200 it's years. been no 200 gas. years since years. there's been gas at the goddamn station. Well, you and think has there really been gas at this point versus some sort of like, you know, atomic radiation Fusion. sort of deal? Well, yeah. I'm not sure we would necessarily know that. But, Grant, my thought would be somebody stole the gas long ago. But the point stands that this is going to quickly become a signal to people from miles around. So I suggest we make like old Cappy and get the fuck out of here. You like make like old so Cappy where? and be old and yell at people. <laughs> Anywhere Are, but we're here. We're in the middle of nowhere, right? <laughs> yeah. In the pitch black? Or is there a moon out? <laughs> yeah, I guess. How dark I is mean, this? there's probably a small moon. I don't know if I would say it's light in the way, but so are, are they, I'm gonna I'm gonna look around, uh, Mr. GM. Are there? I, I feel stupid because I, I I was I was trying to cook slow and low because it is tender, you know. And yeah, it emulsifies right. fat, and you yeah. get through some of that man the the long pig. Uh, I'm gonna yeah. look for um, a fire extinguisher, like in a hurry. Like I feel like a jackass. Like I'm gonna find one. Hopefully. Yep. Uh, give long me. Pig. <laughs> Lung pain. Um, yeah. Let me think about this for a second. A fine fire extinguisher roll. I've got that skill. Here's the thing, though. Even if you were going to find a fire extinguisher, it would have. Ex those things technically expire. Uh, <laughs> I mean, technically, I mean, say technically. After Seventy years, or I mean, like, the whole they have to be inspected. <laughs> they have to be inspected that often. But is there one? Because I'm that guy. I'm going to pull the. Yeah, pen and if and you don't like, expect them, they don't ins expire. Actually. I don't know. What I don't know. What I don't know. Is there one or not? You tell me. <laughs> it's is that Schrodinger's a, is that a Schrodinger's <laughs> extinguisher. <laughs> yeah. I, as, like, as long as you don't observe it. <laughs> like how some chemicals only cause cancer in California, but not elsewhere. Yeah. You know, as long as it's not in California, you're all good. So as I That's used true. to work in accounting. I go find where the HR posters are. I'm sure there are some. By, by Inside the there. flames in the Oh, never fire. mind. <laughs> Shit, that's probably where the fire extinguisher is. Uh, what about by the gas pumps? <clears throat> yeah, I mean, there probably, there probably would have been. Yeah. Um, give me, you know what, tell me what, Give me a perception intelligence. It's going to be a difficulty three. <laughs> Shit, what is that? Uh, so I die. Sorry, sorry. Is that the, is that the scavenger roll? Perception intelligence? No, so I roll one, 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 one
Per, uh, yeah, perception, perception survival. survival. Don't so forget, you, you, you can use action AP. points to increase the number of dice, and you might need to here, yeah, which I would you, recommend. You pretty much have to, unless you're banking on Unless you roll a crit. Yeah, I'll, I'll spend... I'll be that guy. I'll spend an action point. I mean, you can spend multiple. <clears throat> I know. You could spend, like, two, right? Uh, I'm just going to throw this I'm out sure. there. Uh, the way Jordan drew that fire, uh, I don't care how big your fire extinguisher is. Yeah, but, but here's the out. thing. That's <laughs> cool. I'm walking. That's cool. My <laughs> character has no fucking clue. He mm. He's going to grab a fire. Okay, First yeah. of all, understand, Michael, he's grabbing a fire extinguisher not knowing. It's going to be dead. Like, we know this. but It's survival, not how intelligence. So he's he's going to not... Uh, so roll, roll 2d20, perception, survival, or if I... Spend right, point, are you spending any action points one, or no? One point. All right, so then it's three. Three. So 3d20. Okay. Damn. Yeah. And you're going to need three. Oh, we're down an extra point, so we're at five. Mm. Oh, oh, God. Yeah, we're at five. He's searching. He's Damn. searching everywhere. And <laughs> no surprise to anyone. Can is, tuna. Mm. <laughs> there is not anything. What's this? I don't he found a photo of a fire extinguisher. <laughs> Australian bugs. <laughs> yes. yes. So well intact after all these years. <laughs> Yeah. So oh, Cappy is just like, get out of there! <laughs> uh, yeah. Where are you at, Victor? You're still inside. I'm yeah, not, so Victor... I, I, I'm gonna... I'll wander around, around the kitchen or whatever, and as soon as I realize <clears> there's, <throat> there's nothing to be found, I think I just have to get out. Yeah. Yep. You know, like, I'm, I'm not gonna stand yeah. around there until the whole... I'm also convinced, mind you, that there's probably gas somewhere that's gonna explode. Because he worked in finance. He doesn't understand anything. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. So <laughs> that's funny. Yeah. So he, he'll 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 stick near Buck because Buck will shoot the fire or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> Kill it till it's dead. Kill it till it goes out. Yeah. Oh Cap. Oh Cappy's gonna kind of you know be between the group out here. Just watch, and you're all just kind of standing there, just like watching it burn. And uh, Oh Cappy's like, well, that was my plan for a hideout. So uh, I guess I will be doing something after all, Victor. <laughs> Finding a new place for a base of operations. Thanks. I, I, I think I think you? he I, I think he says maybe you can find one that's got bullets instead of old lottery tickets, Cappy. He's just like you <laughs> like just <laughs> under his breath, it's just like uh he's just so bad. Um anyway, uh he's gonna look at the robot and just be like well, there's no suitable structures for cover for, for Miles, really. We're really going to need you to watch out for us while we try to salvage the rest of the night. Uh, at your service, sir. So right. old Cappy's going to try to take you guys to a clearing where it's like, you know, there's a little rock alcove. and It looks relatively... Um, uh, Defensible. Defensible, yeah, that's that's probably the word that I'm I imagine for here. my my thrusters are also providing a tiny bit of light around me, like a little bit of illumination to maybe help people not like trip and stuff, you know. Yep. Old Cappy is going to try to grab some leaves and just like put them up as a blanket, <laughs> you know, and try to cover himself. Uh try to go back to sleep. And he's just muttering as he's going to sleep. God dang, melt your face, <laughs> set the place on fire. <sighs> Oh, melt your face. <laughs> he's just so he's just so cranky. Uh if if this was an achievement based system, I would give you guys an achievement for burning your own house down. <laughs> yeah. Oops. Experience. Experience. <laughs> Negative yeah. six. Uh, <laughs> trait, plus one to setting fires. Yep. Wait, 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 wait. So there are perks. Is there a firefighter perk? Because I'll retroactively go and take that and just be like, <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, it's not. Uh, okay. So then I'm assuming everybody else is doing the same. They're trying to go somewhere, defensible area, sleeping. You're probably now, by the way, closer to each other than you would have been, like uncomfortably. Butts might be touching. I'm just saying, you know, because we're all trying to huddle around. Uh, I'm like, mm. Okay, yep, you're still awake. So we're going to kind of talk through night falling there. Um, and actually, I think given this is 10, 11, I'll probably play our kind of outro scene now. 
As we fade out from the burning red rocket station, everyone is calling home for the night. We zoom through the night sky to a not too distant vision of what seems like an abandoned theme park. Uh, oh, damn it, I don't have my window open. Please hold. Man. Boom. Yeah, to a not uh, distant vision of what seems like uh, an abandoned theme park. Mm -hmm. But as our viewers peer oh, closer, it's gorgeous. glows from night vision goggles, eyes of red creatures, and, or sorry, eyes of red from creatures and shrieking howls of wind busting through old and worn attractions can all be observed. Your eyes kind of focus in on a red and tan sign that once used to bring joy to children's eyes, but now only gives our viewers a sense of wonder and dread of what is to come inside of Nuka World. Ba, ba, ba. So that oh, is our uh, second session. Um, we already got the XP. I will say now you can reset your luck point pools. Yeah. So when we're starting the next session, you will have you should have full luck points. Um, we have yeah. seven action points. Is what I have marked down as well. Yeah. Oh, uh, I, I'm at five. Seven. Yeah, I'm at five as well. Yeah, Go we've down, been, we've, been, we've been building them up throughout this session. I think. Yeah, I know, yeah, but, but we've also used them. I think. No, I'm at, I think, I'm at five. Yeah. Okay. Or five. Yeah. Because we just huh. use an action point on the interaction between Handy and uh, uh, well, Victor used one name? for his his role to search for yeah. shit. Yeah. Five, we're good. Are we good? I, didn't five. Use, I didn't use an action or, point. Sorry, I was thinking the Victor one. You're right. Nice. Uh, if anybody's interested, current kill count. Jack is at three. Oh, you are. Oh, Giger is at yeah. two. Only you care about the two. Oh no! Uh, Listen. Back door opening count one. <laughs> to wow. I've, missed, <clears throat> I've missed every attack so far. I have not hit a <laughs> single person yet. However, you've healed, you've healed two people. MVP no on healing. Yeah. Yes. I can yeah. basically at this point. I can basically out heal. I think most damage that can be done in a turn. On I think you're just you're just you're person. just stealth up, uh, adhering to your uh, Hippocratic oath. You yeah. know, just right. pretending to do. Be no aggressive. Yeah. I was debating about when we go in that hallway with the guy burning about whether I should actually try to help him or kill him, but that's why uh, you have Handy. He's the alternate personality. <laughs> so the things that are yeah. dying, it's Handy's fault. <laughs> yes, oh, ladies no. and gentlemen, if I could, ten fourteen. Uh, if if you're watching this still, um, recognize that that guy in the corner is amazing. One of our newest GMs on the channel. We hope he runs many more games and all these guys. Awesome. And why why is my character always super fucked up? Like what you yeah. almost had the highest kill count of six bodies <laughs> by burning you all <laughs> to the ground. Oh, that's true. That's true. Point is, we will be coming back in two weeks on a Thursday, maybe, probably. Maybe probably. But uh, thanks for watching. Highly likely. Yeah, this has been Myth Brigade, and you have been awesome. Good night.